Hello, everyone. Welcome. Hi. I'm turning off my middies. Wow. Hey there, snucklers. It's your good friend. It's your good friend, the snuck. Are you going to say it's your good friend, the snuckler? No, the, I'm your good friend, the smearer. What? That, no, hang on. No. I'm trying to... Hang on, no, hang on, hang on. I got, I got something. Give me I, a sec. I said I was going to um, not be in the tower zone last time I left off, and then I closed the game, and then I haven't opened it. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> Ideal. Hey, can you stream? Can you stream? Uh, I can try. It's not running so hot right now. Uh, it's probably because it's running hot. I don't know if this will give you sound. Can you hear the game with this? Yeah. Okay. For some reason, Discord always asks for permission thing. to get sound, but sometimes it just doesn't matter. Huh. Oh, that's what I need to do. I need to hide the preview on my stream. Hey, anyway, welcome everyone to the first episode of Dust Amber, and also uh, the final episode of Realms of the Haunting. Hopefully. <laughs> And cometh upon thy wings to me. Ah, uh, you're excited to go to Sheol, Echo? Yeah, I'm excited to go to Sheol in... Give me a second. Seventh Crossed. Seventh Cross. Guest of the Haunting. <laughs> the sequel to Mist. Evolution. That's so many jokes, like, just the for me. The search for Eden. That's so many yeah. jokes just for me. Um, be sure to get your sit sit down with your good oranges and your hot your hot dogs for a good cable TV show. There, that's for the viewers. Okay. I've been. It was basically like that where I just said references. Yeah. Hey. Uh, I need to look at the walkthrough. I think I don't actually want to do that right now, though. I forgot what chapter I'm on. I think I'm, like, on chapter 13? Yeah, like 12 or 13. Oh, good that. lord. Welcome to Dawsember, everybody. Dawsember on... Full motion video. It's Here, Street Hall. we're playing Dawes games... All November. <laughs> <laughs> All throughout September, we're playing DOS games. <gasps> All throughout Jan Amber. <laughs> hang on, hang on. I'm looking at this walkthrough. Continue on the next turn to the left to find a piece of bullet in the A plate. Fourth room contains a mortar and pistol and a plate with the word bong on it? Bong? What? Yo. Okay. Smoke. I read the Welcome to December, where we play DOS games for the month of April. <laughs> this month on cable, too. Every single channel is going to be playing DOS games, even if they're not a fucking gaming show on cable too <laughs> if you see a cable TV show that's not playing dos games you better hop in that chat and be like hey no, what the fuck no it's just me <laughs> it's just for mystery hall this was a joke please don't do that i mean unless they're like cool with it and it's funny but like since you will lose all the return to oh do i have to go i bet you could do it to show I bet, I bet Shiv would find it funny if you were... I don't know what me. long haul game you would find on the DOS. Maybe like Sim Life? Shiv, Shiv could absolutely... I feel like Shiv could long haul like Biosis. 
That's just like don't try to finish the game. <laughs> Just get to the point where you can manage all of the in the fucking that takes bio so long though. It's a long haul. I know the easiest way to deal with it is to run it. Oh, original MS Flight Sim would be a really good pick, yeah. Carry on down the path until you come to a maple stone. What do you mean? The you can install three point one on DOSBox though, right? Extremely loud. Extremely loud. Yeah, 3.1 is like DOS gooey, I assume. Put goo in my dang DOS. Ah, oh, no. Someone gooed up my frickin' DOS. I... This is how you know that, like, computer programmers and users have always been geniuses, because they called it gooey. Yeah. Instead of GUI. Every time you see somebody who says like GUI, no. 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 I think it's transphobic to say oh. GUI, actually. And you should call people <laughs> out. <laughs> Here's the part of the show where Echo makes as many controversial calls to actions as possible. Ah, I love that. I love that part of the show. Okay, so head for Arcor. Look at the tower map. I love having to look at maps in this game. Hey, do you remember which one of these is Arqua? Do you think I retain any information on this game, Riley? I don't even know what's going on. You said Sheol, and that, like, jogged my memory. I forgot that this game was pissing me off. This game is pissing me off. This game is pissing me off. I'm the original Snuckler. I'm not snuckling at all. Not with this game. I'm... Uh... Oh my god, this... Oh my god, this map is having a bad time. Please, please let me... Please load the map. Please load it. Oh god. Oh, Shiv, I'm not the angriest gamer that you ever heard. Oh, I'm not that angry. Oh, I, I need promise. to restart. It's just, I mean, it's real. This game is uh, not running very well. It runs fine outside of the inventory, but the inventory is just running really badly. Yeah, I'm just going to restart real quick. No, I never said that. I never even watched the guy who said that. Don't lie about me, Shiv. See, I can tell you about things that get my goat, but they're usually not video game related. I'm trying to think. What video game gets my goat? Uh, Do you have a your goat, Riley? Do I have a video game that gets my goat, or that gets your goat? Yeah, that gets, that gets your goat. Uh Oh the dame was loaded. Mm. What a shitload of fuck me when I'm playing that game. That was what I said. God yeah. Okay, so fucking Leave the church or run to the mandelstone where the mouse should be transported to the tower. Look at the complete map of the tower. Head for Arco, which is at the bottom left of the map. Take care when you're to the second portal as flying monster attacks as you approach the exit. Okay, so... Brown, what is this? What are you doing? Shit, where are you getting these quotes? I don't even know how someone would compose that sentence. Roll and rock on the roll of rocker. It's uh, probably no, it's fine. Quite, it's funny it's, to me. Yeah, it's probably decently funny to people who have literally ever seen anything that that man has made. <laughs> I think I like when I was like younger and when it was like good and new. I, w I probably saw like the beginning of an EVGN video and I was just like, this is cringe. And then I never watched any of it. Damn. Ironically, everything that I actually watched on YouTube was uh, 
hot garbage, but yeah, that's where I drew the line. Just the, the oh god, oh god, you guys shoot norbs at me. Ah, I think just saying the letters is fine, especially if you've only read them. So, because like. It is ironic that you found out that you normally say GUI instead of GUI by a show that's pronounced CSI or NCIS. Yeah. So, I think we should call the, like, Internal Navy Police Department NCIS. Yeah. I agree. Down with NCIS. I don't. I don't know. What's I? Th I feel like there's some nuance to the concept of military police because on the one hand, fuck cops, but on the other hand, I feel like the military do be needing somebody to regulate them who has guns. Did the military? To which the laws that govern he has decreed. Nothing can be brought to this realm that parallels the I don't know, that show wasn't about actual cops anyway. It was like it was about terrorism. Unfit. They will be returned at your departure. Oh shit, he Further, fucking only one device exists that may be taken from this realm. The sword eternity. He oh, took my I items. Adam, but I, I don't have audio because you're not streaming. I it's just a it wasn't like FMV, it was just the portal cutscene, but what he was saying was just that, hey, uh, you don't have any items anymore. It's smoked. For this, for this one, you have to go to heaven, and they don't let you have items in heaven. Well, this isn't heaven. Didn't they say this wasn't heaven? This is Arqua, which is the divine realm. Arqua, well, it's specifically not heaven. I remember somebody was like, this is Aqua. Is not heaven. Heaven's different. Shields definitely hell, and they're the same thing, but Aqua and Heaven are not. There's a multiple divine realm. Man, there's so many things that I haven't, like, gotten all the fucking info about, but I just do not care at this point. There's so much, so much lore. Yeah. I have a scroll. What does the scroll say? Oh my god. Why is the game running so poorly? Scroll. Vellum, isn't it? Yes, animal hide. You must be the chosen in search of the sword of the dragon, eternity. This is Ark of the Divine, rule of purity and peace. Oh my god. Ah! This is really bad. Why is it so... Why is it so bad? What am I doing that's making it run so bad? Browser? No, my browser's closed. That's normally the problem, but it's not this time. God, I missed this song. Everyone was talking about how it was dragging on really long last time, but I'm already happy to hear it again. <laughs> like, I'm not even joking. This is not a joke right now. I genuinely um, find this to be like the best song in the game. I'm glad. I do hope we're not here for like hours again. Yeah, that would be good. Is it possible this game just doesn't perform well in DOSBox? The thing is, is that I, like, it's been running, like, bearably, like, for the rest of the fucking streams. Like, it's been a little bit slow, but... Not nearly this bad. Yeah. Are you streaming at a higher, like, frame rate and resolution? No, I'm going resolution? with... I'm going with or... Oh my god, okay, it was because I had Discord on my second monitor. That was it. Moving it to my oh. main monitor made it run so much better. What the fuck? That's so funny. Well, for all this, you know, it's the uh, same. It's required to use one element to produce another from the wrong ingredients. 
Smart card to use one element to produce another from the raw ingredients you have found. Take the four elements to the Ring of Eight and place them correctly. They will conjure the presence of the Hafarze. When you look upon the face of Tistria, take up the elements again and combine them. Remember that what pleases us often pleases the divine also. Consider which of your senses is as yet untouched. When the scent of success sweetens the air, you will achieve your mind's desire. Hey, what does any of this mean? Who knows? I have to combine the elements. Four elements in their absolute state. We are trying to use one element to produce another of the raw ingredients you found. Oh. Yeah. Alright. Well, I guess let's go hunting. This game really backloads a lot of its mazes. Yeah. It's like... I feel like generally the segments that are outside of the house of this game are kind of worse. Oh! Hey, this is that dark area full of guys that you were in before, but this time it's light. Is it? Yeah, remember when you were in that big area and you had to run around because there were a lot of guys who were shooting at you? I thought that And the guide told you not to not to bother with them? No, it's just slightly different. It's similar, but it's slightly different, but it's very it's, it's kind of parallel. What the fuck am I doing? what? Anyway, you know what really gets my goat? This is incredible. You're telling me. I love Recently, water. I love water. Water doesn't get my goat. I love water. Some mosaic or something. There's power at work here. Powers of transportation and movement. But we're at the end of it. What gets, your what gets my goat? Mist 4. That's true. Revelations. More like revelations of garbage. Miss one, good game. Miss two, exceptional game. You could call it perfect, if not for a couple flaws that are uh, valid to bring out. Um, I don't remember how to jump. Miss three, uh, miss three, miss three. Miss four is bad. It attempts to undermine not only the story of the first Mist game, but just like abandons the interesting themes that Cyan World set up completely. Riven Squeakle the Mist? Accurate. Riven Squeakle the Mist, yeah. I assume it was a sort of uh, Glass Onion situation where they called it Riven and then someone was like, you, you, you should really. You should really let people know that this is the sequel to one of the best, the best known games of all time, um, or they're not gonna know. So it's just this big. You can walk around the house. This house. So there's got to be something in here, right? It's not much of a maze. How come you don't have to do that in books, but you have to do that with movies and games? Yeah, I don't know. It's whack. I... I mean, you well, do the thing is... You have to do it with books, because people put the name of the series on the book. Yeah, cover, but like, they're just like... Yeah, it's just like a sticker. Or something. It's like in... Like, on the subtitle, and it's not included in the official title of the thing. Like... Yeah. I think that makes books harder to approach. <laughs> um... Like, I'm, I generally have trouble paying attention to a book in general, but often I, like, hear about something and I just don't know what's going on. Because someone says, like, the name of the third Game of Thrones book or whatever. I don't know how many of those books there are. And I just don't know. I'm like, oh, a fantasy book? Cool. Uh, also, I do, why does it feel normal to name a movie or game? Name two, but if you name a book name two, I'll recoil in horror and fear. I think the third storm one is a storm of swords. Yeah, I would not. Like, I know the first one is called A Song of Ice and Fire because that was like someone told me when I was watching the show that that was the original name. Um, so I was like, oh, okay, yeah, that makes sense. And they like say it in the show, so I was like, okay, that makes sense. That's like a thing that they say. This is so but I would not connect 
that like very loose grammatical connection to a storm of swords. I don't. I think. A Wait, storm, the series. I thought that was a joke. I thought that was a joke. Is it really called a storm Wait, of swords? I believe that it's the sort of storm of swords. It is a Game of Thrones. I thought a Game of Thrones wasn't the name of one of the books. No. Yep. This is the first book. Uh. Oh man, I should have used a health potion before I came into this location. I don't either find it into the first gate. Come to go to the house and look around until you find a health that has red on it. Okay. There's five released books in this series. I, th I thought there was like two or three. Oh, yeah, that's a long series. How do people write so many books? Here we go, the red one. There's like two, there's one that's listed as forthcoming and one that's listed as unreleased. Kind of have like stairs? Why do you have to have an evil teleporter to get upstairs? It's fucking aqua, Riley. Stairs are not accessible. This is the aqua. But the teleport the pad area. makes me feel bad. It's so loud. Piece of flint. Might come in handy later. I can't sense any magic from it though. Yeah, we're in aqua. Uh, we're again. In, we're in aqua. Is it an R? In it? I. The man who speaks to us, I remember saying aqua. Can you sense well, but there's an R. There, I just want you to know that there's an R in the word. Oh, is it still playing the creepy haunted house music if you're in heaven? There's only one way to find out. <laughs> No, this is the music it plays in Aqua. Also, Aqua is not heaven. Not sure. Could be. I'm gonna feel really dumb if I like mistakenly remembered this, but I'm well, no. almost certain that they did say that Aqua is not heaven. They, I'm pretty sure they did. Yeah. I think this is technically they true. Were... I love them in Ghost Written prequels. I don't know why I know so much about this, this series. I like fantasy books, but I really don't like anything past the first Saga and Fire Book. You're just the knower. Wait. Yeah, because I know there's like a prequel the the sh follow up show got based on that was like just I think it was written like a historical book because people were talking about how the show was like they made a whole like show out of it, which meant that it was a lot of like new writing to make it function as a traditional story. I didn't know that was ghost written. That's interesting. I just hate that it like it has to noise blast me every time I go in the teleporter. Also, I'm in Egypt again. Fuck. <laughs> Look at the FMV, it's showing exclusively about the works of George R. 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 I, well, not if he's getting <laughs> ghost <-written> books. <laughs> fire Mystery Vault. <laughs> Songs of Ice <laughs> and Fire Mystery Vault. You know what really gets my goat? The House of the Dragon show. <laughs> You know what that show is? It's like the beauty of making a show about like how your main characters are suffering, like tragic shows and stuff like that. The beauty of that is that when you're doing that, you can fridge your protagonists. You can take your main characters and you can who are women and you can treat them like shit for no reason. Yeah. I don't know, I watched that show because my sibling wanted to watch it with me, because we watched all of Game of Thrones together. But really, after watching all of Game of Thrones together, I don't know, I don't understand. I didn't understand, I was like, I don't know why you want to watch this. I'll watch this with you, it could be fun, but I don't know why you want to watch more of that. They kind yeah. of, they kind of didn't do a good job. It was like good for a while, it was like, what, good enough? Uh, <laughs> Every time you go through the teleporter, it makes a horrible, horrible noise. First book is kind of a masterpiece, according to Shiv. And the first season of the show is also really good. Basically, everything past I saw. Yeah, I don't. I couldn't really tell you in memory when the show gets worse. Um, I think there is something transcendent about the last season of the show because I really like garbage. 
I think it's yeah. interesting garbage. There's like a scene where a character who has basically nothing to do in the story anymore gets to uh, ride on an inexplicable, like unexplained white horse through like a war-torn city. And I remember when it happened, it felt like I was dreaming. It was like... They never acknowledge it afterwards or before. It just is a scene that happens. <laughs> and it's really interesting to just do that with no interest in any... Like, it doesn't fit in the show. It's not like the show does things like that. Uh, it's just, like, weird in a bad way, but that almost wraps it around into being good again to me. Yeah, because you like garbage. Yeah, I like interest in garbage. Yeah, yeah. And it's like an interesting sequence. If you took it out of context, and if it was like an AMV or something, I'd be like, this is pretty cool. <laughs> Game of Thrones AMV. <laughs> okay, what the fuck do I do now? Uh... In each corner of the fountain, there is a shimmering door which you cannot walk through. Fill the chalice in the fountain. Oh, okay. My chalice attack! That's your chalice attack. Fear my chalice power! <laughs> Chalice Brilliant blast. subversion with fantasy tropes. And maybe should have been a follow-up that deals with the consequences of that. And then it should have ended. Yeah, well, I mean... That was, like, the thing that was interesting about the show early on, right? Is that it was all about, like, consequence. Like, something happened, and then there were, like, massive rippling consequences from this thing that's, like... It's not mundane, but it, it is small compared to what happens. But then, like, the problem with that is things ripple out so far that eventually consequences are kind of meaningless. It's not like, oh, a small thing happened and then it made big things happen. It's like, oh, uh, everything's on fire. Yeah, the thing about stories like that is that you really have to balance the, like, level of personal versus, like, global consequence to make things still feel impactful. Because if yeah. everything sucks all the time, then it's just like, okay, well, I'm just going to disengage because you're clearly not caring about, like... Hello, Sinum. Or Snow. I think that's Snow. BP. Yeah, I, I was very honored that BP demanded that everyone watch this uh, funny video game. What the fuck? Oh. Where the fuck is... The... Do I get the bong plate yet? When do I get the bong plate? Martin is taking so long to write the Winds of Winter that they're gonna have to get Sanderson to finish it for him. I, 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 I don't. I don't get it. But yeah, I, sh I don't get it. But I believe another, that that's a funny another joke. fantasy author. Where is the bong plate? Where is the bong? Plate? I think, I think George R. R. Martin should get the guy who wrote the fucking Aragon books to finish. <laughs> We should outsource. We sh we should have someone who's like writes out the outline for a really big fantasy epic, uh, that's like really well thought out and well executed. And then like writes the first book, maybe like several books, and then just hands it off to various YA authors, like it's a Star Wars novel series, um, and just like see where it goes, you know. See what happens. This one is stuck fast. Something written here. Burn? Three major writers of modern epic fantasy. Martin, Robert Jordan, Wheel of Time, and Brandon Sanderson, the Stormlight Archive, Mistborn, the Cosmere. Okay, I've heard of yes! all of those the names. Bong? What does that mean? Your guess is this Bong! <laughs> It's written like a shit post. This blue tile. I can read it now. Why does it look so Bong? shitty? Bong? Why is it so good? Nice. That looks like a fucking MS Paint Adventures drawing. What the fuck is this? Bong? 
bong? You can't mean? just put it's bong in this game? I love how he says bong. This blue tile. I can read it now. Bong? Your guess is as good bong? as mine. I just want to get like a clip of him sound the same bong. And just bong. be able to replay it whenever I want. Scroll. Something there. Can't make it out though. Mm. It's gonna be handy right now. Burn. I wonder what this says. Bong? He's like, okay, okay, okay. He's like, hmm, I can't make out what it says on this scroll. <laughs> it says bong. It says bong? Something written here. Burn? He re okay, yeah, he really did have to use the magnifying glass to find out that it said burn in huge letters. Oh my god. Paper fan. Oriental. The designs, the yin and the yang. The yin and the yang. I don't think that's like... To... That sucks, Shiv. Metal flask. This is just is like get her robot. Keep it close, Adam. It's very magical. That's true. No, you're right. It okay. is good that they uh, tell you... I just think it's like... I don't. Oh, uh, uh, you're a chipmunk. You're a chipmunk. Okay. I just think it's funny that he, that like, I don't Hello, know why you need not. a magnifying glass to read it. Hello, doll. I uh, sorry for monking out. Yeah, I know. That's I, I know good. you can't help it. Where we get a little simian here. Um, <sighs> I'm I'm something of a. Yeah. I'm something of a weird chipmunk. Yeah, the first yeah, time I join a voice call every day, uh, it's like the full moon to me. I think give you big handfuls of nuts so that you can fill up your cheeks. Whoa, that seems to have oh, more comfy. Nuts. Yeah. What are we playing? Like almonds and walnuts yeah. and chestnuts. Not peanuts, though. Those aren't real nuts. Uh... Is this a Doom Ward? Uh, no, this is Realms of the Haunting, which is a yeah. FMV game, which is basically a proto-survival horror. Interesting. That uh, has, like, Doom shooter elements and also point-and-click puzzles like I'm doing right now, but, like, in a Doom area. Something really well, it's gorgeous. Wrong. Yeah. yeah, it's very good. The like settings, the set designs are all really, like the area designs are really cool, uh -huh. and it's like just really unique uh, in its like presentation. It was actually released in the same year as Resident Evil. Um, the spirit. So like it's the spiritual concurrent evolution. Spiritual wor world building is pretty terrible, but the game itself, charming. Metal bowl and black. About the bowl and it's now. got a really good soundtrack. Magical. Bowl and snow. It's snow. The powders changed to snow. Mm, oh. Yeah. Two powders must have been cut. Straw. Of sorts. It's tinder. God, uh, yeah. Very combustible in this form. Uh, thinking about like Crater, he's really good, but also just like, oh man. Oh okay. shit! We got him! Oh my god! Oriental tobacco pipe. It is a literal bong! The principles that the smoke's drawn up through the water in the vase area from whatever's being burned. Whatever being the operative word. I got the bong! Bong? Fuck yes! Bong acquired. Why is that a puzzle element? 
There is the if, oh, for context. He's gonna Dom, have to like. I mean, you're gonna have to fucking smoke please? some mystical weeds. Please look Bomb. at this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's stuck fast. Maybe you're gonna have to smoke some mystical this weed stuck fast. and and go on a spiritual journey. Maybe later. Maybe later. Maybe later. He doesn't want to smoke right now. Maybe later. Straw. Of sorts, I... it's tinder. Very combustible in this form. Oh, I need a. Maybe I need to fill it with water first. Yeah, because it's the steam. I was up really late last night, and so I started reading uh, Blam again by Tsutomo Nihei, uh, which is like a really, really good comic Open. that good. it's like international acclaim and is very influential to like sci-fi sci and cyberpunk aesthetics. Um, What's it called again? Blam, it's spelled Blam. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but it yeah, is yeah. supposed to be Blam. Um, and I'm just like oh, reading love, through it again. I, and, and going, like, I haven't read it yet. Or Blam, sorry. Right, yeah. Hey. It's really good it's and it's really it's gorgeous. It's and I read it after the other internationally well known work that Tsutomu Nihei has done. Uh, and I didn't read it for a while because I saw that it was by the same person and I was like, I don't want to fucking do another comic by this person. But actually, uh, when he's just, like drawing really gorgeous backgrounds and like very unique style of character and amazing mechanical design and like minimal dialogue, it's really gripping. But he's also made Knights of Sidonia, which has a lot of dialogue and much more conventional storytelling, despite also having really beautiful backgrounds and mechanical design. And the thing about Knights of Sidonia is that it's kind of bad. Mm -hmm. Sometimes less is more. Yeah, it's literally like, it's this story, it's very like, uh... It's in the genre, I'm gonna forget the name of the show, but it's in it's, the genre of, like, we're all, we're all on a, uh, a, like, colony ship in deep space, and the aliens are attacking us, and we're just, like, surviving out here, sort of, that genre of thing. Um, and, like, it has a lot of cool stuff to say about that, but also, like, in the middle of that, there's, like, the main characters just getting several people just like attracted to him in like a really goofy rom-com sort of like harm manga thing way mm. and it's like you've got a weird fucked up either. worm you've got a weird fucked up worm mech alien alien thing that's really interesting because it's like connecting to humanity but it's connecting to humanity by being one of the main characters waifus and i don't like it <laughs> I do think it's a fun, like, I think if it was not, like, just following traditional anime conventions, which I haven't seen or read the manga, uh, but, like, I've heard people, I've heard a friend talking about it, like, and saying that it has cool ideas, although I don't know her actual opinions on the whole story as a whole. Uh, I do kind yeah. of like the idea that, like, uh, of, um, romance with a big alien, because I think that's, yeah, that's, like, fun. It it's a cool idea, it's just the way that that's, like, just, it's, like, constantly at odds against, like, for example, the other character who is fully genderless, because it is established very early on that Maybe a bunch later. of people are just kind of born fully, fully sexless and genderless, uh, and then this character, uh, because they, uh, fall in love with oh, the main character, God. a guy start to uh naturally like turn into a woman yeah, as a result of that. I don't like that. <laughs> it's not good. Yeah, it's bad. And like I won't say that Blam is like super 
It Blan isn't like better in the sense that it like handles those topics better. It's better in the sense mm. that it just doesn't bother. Gold, you say? It's not about that. Gold, you say? Can't make this out. Any ideas? No, not really. Hmm. I must hear you thinking. But yeah, I can. Blam is really, really good, and honestly, I'm sure Nights of Sidonia is fun for some people. I know I've talked yeah. to a lot of folks who liked the show. Yeah, Nights of Sidonia has cool ideas, it seems, um, that... It's two character voices? Time to put the offering together, I think. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, there's a... I have a party member. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I have a party member who's like a psychic. She's just like following me around at all times. Yeah. I can talk to her about the neurosphere. Because she's a psychic. This looks like something else. Perhaps. Alf's breastplate. The curious. It makes me feel somehow. I'm not sure. I feel ready to take on anything. That's surprising. The cuirass is imbued with Alf's courage. Yeah, I really, um, obviously, I mean, I'm the one running the show that's all about playing FMV games, but, like, I do really like, this game has really good FMV in it. Yeah. Wow. This is... You're telling me. Can you sense anything unusual from this, Rebecca? I couldn't at first. Yeah, I can feel it. It's almost as if the water's alive. Okay, I think that's correct. Let me check. Oh, I need to actually use this one. Okay, so then I have to... Okay, okay. Hang on, is it just not gonna let me do it now? Hey, what? Nice and all letting me place it back down. Okay, I have to take them back into my inventory anyway, but I activated the thing, so I did the puzzle. So then I- I'm glad that I can just carry this burning tinder in my hands. Just like have a campfire in my pocket. This is snow. Odd. Water pipe. A hookah, if I'm not mistaken. Oriental tobacco pipe. Okay, so now I can get fucking- Uh, you know. Use the amber with the mortar and pestle to make incense. Place the snow on a very way light symbol. Ugh. Water pipe. Oh, fuck yeah. I love this bong puzzle. Don't pick things up for themselves, Adam. What? what? Oh, are we get? Do we get to watch him? No, we don't get to watch him smoke the pong. Smoke the pong. I'm sad. Oh hi, is that God? <laughs> Here's your pong, dude. Thanks, bro. Amen. Thanks, bro. I really needed that. <laughs> Let's fucking go. <laughs> oh. Fucking. 
Yo. <laughs> this is so good. Whoa. Oh. The weed sword. The power of bong. Smoking that shit that turns it into a sword. Dragon sword. <laughs> Dragon sword. That's the new name of my... That's the name of my weed strain. Dragon sword. Why does God smoke sword weed? Now we're finally gonna get some answers. I'm sad they did that thing of like the helmet and breastplate like disappearing. Presumably so it's easier to film things out of sequence, but I did think it would be funny that he just had to wear the helmet and breastplate for the rest of the game, like in in those FMV sequences. Yeah. His jacket is so good. It's like so fucking 90s. He has like a very, very distinctive outfit. <laughs> this is supposed to be a powerful weapon, but I found that it was not very good at all. But I found Al Stagger to be the most useful, followed by the Wanderbus. Oh shit! It's like a sword that you can just use and then it charges up a projectile. Okay, that's like neat, I guess. Finally a melee weapon. Finally a melee weapon that's not punching. Uh, how do I get back down? Just jump out the window? No. This connects with the pavilion. The one in the garden, yes. But it's only one way. Uh, is it this one? There we go. Hey, I don't like that music. Kind of eerie. Okay, here I am in the Slade. There's like a thousand textures. Oh my god, how will I know? It's- this is so whimsical for a dune like Yeah, it's- it's like really fantastical and it's just like the- it's like taking things from Doom and I just really like that it is like not the form of the survival horror that won out because Resident Evil was so much more popular, but it really is following the same like design trends and like has a lot of similar stuff. But it was released in the same year, so like they are just concurrent games that were designed in similar fashions. Just one of them was also a point and click adventure game, which uh was like because become as one fucking Resident Evil has a bit of that, but not nearly as much. Is it? There's a texture file in this game called AA Shitty. In the game that I'm playing? <laughs> or... Yeah. <laughs> I downloaded the textures one. Um, That's so funny. I don't think I'm gonna... You don't want AA Shitty? I want... A shitty is nothing. It's literally like a nothing thing. Um, there's no actual image associated with it. Hello, how are the realms? Uh, well, they're quite haunting. Uh, I'm up to chapter 14? So, 14 out of 20. Same. True. I need to turn run off because these fucking pathways are so scary. I need to save my game is what I'm doing. What am I talking about? I need to save my freaking game.
These are all grayscale. I've never worked with Doom modding before, so I don't know what I'm doing here. What I do know is that there's no texture titled Bong, so this is kind of a that's, lot to sift through. That's fucking sad. Is there anything that looks like Arqua? Is it like named by region? Ar... Look there, above the mount, the legions of dark. A Q. Oh, here's some stuff. In A Q, there's like the fire. These look really fucked up. Why do these look like that? Which is near the top of the map. I need to find the right map in my fucking inventory. There we go. Near the top of the map. And to the right of the one which brought you here from St. Michael's. Okay, so that means that I need to go... Do I get this? Because I need to go to Sheol now, but I don't know how to get to Sheol. Oh, maybe I need to go to the one that's... Oh, oh, right, no, I need to go to this one. Oh, shit, the, the goose is loose. Gamers, the goose is loose. Beast is freezed. Controls for this game, not so great. It's like arrow keys, and you also have to use the mouse to do point and click things. And it's like the fires of Roth, he shall consume. A lot of very awkward controls. Is it this one? Is it this one just here? Is this where I want to go? Know that you stand before the tower and possess the right of passage. You do have the right of passage now. Combine the face with the soul. Combine the face with the soul. Okay, so what I need to do is it's to the right of the one that. What you hear from seeing this walkthrough kind of fucking dog shit. <gasps> okay, this is using Doom 2 palette. Okay, apparently, I want to discuss the sword with Rebecca. So now we have Eternity, the Dragon Sword. This thing's as light as a feather, you know? Death, Adam, is as light as a feather. Duty is as heavy as a rock. Okay. Use it well. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. So now we have a Death. Thank you. 
Now all we've got to do is take the dragon sword to the chamber of the soul stone. Not going to be an easy trip, that's for sure. At last. Eternity. This is why I've been brought here. Everything has been leading to this. The sword of Florentine's dreams. The sword of the dragon. I can feel its power. Its energy. It's part of me. But there's another. I can feel their energy connecting with mine and the swords. Who can it be? So close. Okay, apparently you can... I just have to go back to the house. So the thing that I... The other work that I was reading? That. Not a good work through. Apparently there's like you can do some monster hunting to find some potions. Which like could be useful. But I don't know if I can be bothered. I feel like I might actually want to because like... It's kind of... Uh, it's not, a, not so great. Yeah. Resource management in this game kind of tricky, because I have uh, it's been a long, been a long game. My the amount of potions I'm picking up is uh, small. Man, this game has some good ass textures. Yeah. Let me tell ya. Oh god, this is not a. Not screen. Oh my god. Uh... What? Whoa! Block, block texture for each position of the minute hand. Oh my god, you can stagger enemies with the sword! Oh, that's so funny! I love the sword, actually. This is great! Okay, oh. they do have, like, moments to walk closer to you, but they're not getting attacks off. Yeah, like, you can really, if you click fast enough, you can do really good damage. I warned you against making the dodge on your own. Now we will all pay. Well, that gave me a bunch of potions, so I guess I'll go get more potions. Because these guys just drop potions on it. Oh my god, skulls. Bloody skulls. There's like a spine in here. This is such a good pick. Fucking running away? Wait, here's another A shitty, but this one is actually bone. Okay, I actually have like a ton of health versions down, so I'm just gonna go. The sword? Really good. I like it a lot. There's nothing else in the game staggers enemies that much. Yeah, it's like a little riskier because you gotta be close to them, but. Man. Well, let's. I did see what happens next on the walkthrough, so. Whoa. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Scary zombies. It's so hard to see anything that's happening right now. Is that my dad? That's my dad. Adam, help me. For the love of God, help me. It's late for your father now, wouldn't you say, Adam? You can't certainly run out early. Veins. 
His only hope really is you. And there you are with your hands tied behind your back. Metaphorically speaking. That silly girl. Loving son watching his father being beaten. Humiliated. You have made this a very personal battle. Okay. Well, what are you going to do, Adam? Okay, you bastard. Let's do it. Adam. Powerful amulet. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Screaming sound, the prisoner. Like, that went really great for you, Adam, didn't it? You really, uh, really fucked it. God damn it. Shit. Quiet. Now I'm going to look after your father. You can watch if you like. Okay, immediately another FMV cutscene, huh? Not that I'm arguing. Yeah, hey, you're, you're in fucking prison. Yeah, but I was reading it. I wanted to read a piece of paper. No one let me. Okay, well, I didn't get to read any of the paper. Rebecca? Rebecca? Where are you? Well, I have no idea. I'm in a cell somewhere. I hate that the captions are the RuneScape <laughs> font. <laughs> You're right, it is the RuneScape font. Oh my god. It's invisible. I love that. But it won't stop you getting hurt. Yes, but Rebecca, he's he's got the sword, the key, the shrine. That's he's wearing those gloves again. That's so we can hold the damn thing. I don't give up. I'll try and get to you. In the meantime, I'll see what you can do. You might not have the sword, but you do have that blunderbuss. Tall redeemed efficient chips. Coming right up. Step right up, get them fish and chips. Oh my god, did that fucking. Okay, well, I took all the things anyway, so I can just read them. Okay, how did you do that? <laughs> By the way, what did you like? Have... Do you have magic? I, like, I know you're a psychic, but I don't think that includes welding open doors. It's a really impressive <laughs> magic ability that she has. Game Quarter says, no, RuneScape uses the realms of the haunting font. True. I think RuneScape did come after... I don't actually know. I can't say that confidently. Yeah. I would assume RuneScape came after this. RuneScape wasn't out for, like... Boss. 
is the thing. It's not a DOS game. Yeah, that's true. It's a browser game. It's in Java. This mentions my father. Java's kind of a modern programming language. Research. What happened to the day of the 6th of December? That's when the people of the parish of St. Michael's near Holston are asking... All residents claim to have slept from the evening of the 5th right through the way through the morning of the 7th. Huh. That's weird. Surgeons. What's this about? I wonder three... if it's got anything to do with Belial. Uh, three of France's most noted and distinguished medical dermatology surgeons are still reported as missing after a three-week absence from their respective hospital practices in Lyon. Hmm. There's something written on this. Looks old and... Okay, now that's... The supremacists of revelation. Interesting theory. Religious leaders of a new final land movement have proclaimed to discover the truth behind the mystery known as Crop Circle Phenomena. Nor do they believe the result of it. Crop Circle's Orton Report would have us believe the direct link with the Earth is a focal point for the devil. Each successive appearance for a circle of the religious movement known as the Spirits of Revelation believe that the devil is able to take one step closer to the day when he. Okay. Oh. Rub circles are the devil's, the devil's work. Six local women. You know, paper is printed on. that's not the explanation I usually hear, so you gotta give them points for... Yeah, for originality. I don't know if originality is the right <laughs> word. People in the rural parish quarrel have recently discovered that six local women who vanished in the same hour on the same night two days ago, most of the women were not acquainted. I wonder if that's where Florentine got the equipment. Too much of a coincidence, isn't it? I killed a, I killed an astronomer. He was stated as having slept through the fire and there were little local fire raids, got in the order to continue the registration. Bizarre fire sweeps Europe. A series of fires in homes and estates around Europe's continuing to baffle as an investigation. Is that my cat doing a stretch? It was. Alright, well, I'm free from prison already. That was quick. Look at the state of this. You were expected to use this. A barrack. <laughs> okay! Okay! Okay. This is... This chair is fine. Like, it's wooden. It's a fine wooden chair. Yeah, it's just, it's, yeah, it looks like a sturdily built wooden chair. Look at the state Look at of the this. State of you this. were expected to use this. A barrack. A barrack! You were expected to sit in an uncomfortable chair. <laughs> Truly barbaric. From the servant of the devil to expect you to sit in an uncomfortable chair. You can sit on your fucking bed. You were expected to use this. A barrack. A barrack. Bed is fine. It doesn't look comfy, but it's like I'm put in a fucking cell. I got a bed and a chair, you know. At least I'm not shackled to the wall. Maybe the reason that that he, they'd say it's barbaric is because that's the toilet. No, nothing. Whoa! Yo! Whoa! Who put all this here? Yummy. I don't need any of these ammos anymore, but I'll take them. Hey, Raleigh, do you want to know something about the texture files in this game? Hey, what's this? Is this the source Riley? of the magic you detected? Uh, the what? Tell me. So there's some texture files in here. There's uh, some two letter and some three letter with another prefix that I don't understand here to sort of refer to the things that are in Aqua. However, some of them do just say the whole thing. 
they say here uh the beginning of the of the file name a q u a aqua oh shit it's just aqua okay i don't know why it's spelled in the game now. files Billy. yeah i don't know maybe they changed it later because they were like that just means water we should change it they had already recorded audio i don't know i don't, I don't know Time of beast, damn it to eternal light. How can my mind have created such a creature? Fosters destroyed the homes and libraries and most of the temples most intellectually. The Dodger. The Dodger went around burning a bunch of people's houses. Taken away from me so much in this place left hatred, contempt, and the burning desire to destroy it any way that I can. I must learn to quell my rage. It only fuels the Dodger more. The Dodger is I, and I the Dodger. I knew this would attain substance. I must know it now. Strange man. Could he be the one who weird the sword and lost, right? Oh, that, yeah, that was me. They have the six quickly approaches. Belial, must I know now reconsider? Must I now reconsider my allegiance with my old friend? Is is it I who owe him, or is it he that must pay the debt? No, I cannot come to this. Our goals are surely the same. See my old friend. Rarely see my old friend these days. Anyway, lest ooh, even the chance to arise that I may speak to him. Always the reticence. Ah, da, 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 da. When I do transpire me as poured over some tome or grimoire, frantically etching out our something and symbols, I must not question Belial's loyalty. I must promise myself that despite what the power believes, the years of solitude and the binding to this place must take its toll at some point. That if I remember well was that day that Belial took on the Dodger and barely escaped. I've never seen him like that before nor since. Yes, that must be it. I'm sure of it. The Dodger hounds both he and I. Who are watchful aidants of this damned beast? With the breaking of the sixth, the seventh, and the last would be revealed to us. The one power grows impatient. Soon, yes, very soon, it will be gone. Be done. I have not seen Belial for three months now. Where is he? I need him for the right of in, in perception tomorrow. If all goes well, I will be able to create twelve something for my use around the grounds. There have been far too many people moving close to the area of late, and we need a little protection. The field that these creatures generate when in close proximity to each other will lead to a cloaking of the house and temple. Hopefully the house will not appear to exist, either, neither will there be any compulsion to walk the grounds. Despite our efforts, the creature we captured in the chamber of the soul Stone refuses to speak. Raciel now has him under the key. Bly believes him to be one of the Watchers, that legendary race of Elohim that, that I am unsure. Dreams of the Sword have returned. This time my love is connected with them. She was in the chamber with a stranger in the sword. Wait, Florentine's lover is the fucking is the lady is rachel i cannot tell who held the sword off standing as they were between the soul stone and myself she wore a face of anguish what map of graveyard maze oh boy it's another maze oh are you excited for this we love mazes on this show At least I love mazes on this show. Yeah. And what's this bone texture? You know, I didn't expect it to be this hard to find. The text saying company. Yeah. Considering it was really easy to get into the textures of the game. Where's the bomb? This is how you get RSIs. Now, playing this game. Hitting the down key on my keyboard over and over again. Oh, Roughly no. 1,000 times. Human. All right, yeah. Bone looks human. It is. How do you know that? 
All right, graveyard time. It's funny that it was really easy to find the textures for the symbols where you put all put the stuff in the same place in the game as that, with like the elements. Oh my god, there's so many fucking guys here. Yeah, you're really getting your ass beat. You considered just like not getting a hit. I should try that. You're right. That's a good idea. Glad I could help. What's the point in this game where I get distracted? Then it's like I don't even know what's going on on screen. Well, uh, I'm in the prison, and uh, I need to escape. And there's a maze, because this game, the back half of this game is just mazes, apparently. Yeah. I did hear that the back half of this game is less good than the front half. I don't like entirely I... necessarily agree with, but it's like I don't really like them. How many how many mazes there are? I think mazes are fun. Well, the thing is, is that it gives you a map, so it's just checking the map over and over again. Mm. And if you need a map to make your maze solvable, I think you made a bad maze. I found the text. Oh, nice. So what part I hear you say, Florentine? Do the creations you call God and Satan calculate within this equation? Both are present, but both are without. These powers are the center of this world. It would be pointless to say otherwise. Uh... This is two textures, by the way, I'm swapping between, and it's really hard once I am now in the middle to not lose my place instantly. God. These powers are the sum... These powers are the sum total of man's thoughts. Without form, for they are not fully conceived, they constantly germinate and die within the soul stone. Oh, are you doing... It's like the text that is on the walls... Yeah. They vie for the thoughts of man, and when one becomes stronger, it will take on a form and come again into this realm. So you see, both these powers are the sum total of this world at any one time, and until now have shared this place, but not for much longer. This world, in which you live, is becoming corrupt, and the pure thoughts of men are dwindling past. Dwindling fast. Thank you for letting it me is... know. Sorry. Thank you for letting me know, Tala. That my um my keyboard was triggering my V2 my FM VTuber, so I was just kind of beatboxing ambiently, like silently. Hell yeah. Anyway. It is to the dark side of man's mind that the path is leading. The road, which even now which is even now forming the future. Two will come, Florentine. Two men. Two men will come? Two men will come? That's kind of gay. <laughs> Shut up. That's a little... What fucking joke were you making then, huh? No, it's just the, 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 just the fucking it. extra bit you added. You don't like the... When I point out... That it's a little fruity for oh. some people who might not be able to get the joke super quick. You know, some people yeah. they they don't know they don't. It's harder for them to spot jokes, and that's okay. I I want to make it I want to make it more accessible for them. I'm fruity like that. I don't. Nobody will understand my jokes. If, if you don't understand my jokes the first time, you don't get them. Is it accessibility to make sure everything you do is fully inaccessible to everybody? 
No, it's the opposite then it's of that. Like, kind of, it's, but then it's it kind not, of the same accessibility just, for everyone. And everyone's get, on the same page. It's technically equality, I guess, but it's not accessibility. It's the opposite of it. Inaccessibility. Yeah. This, this is what yeah, we that. should practice. I really like those those games that are designed with like really specific audio experiences so that folks who are like have trouble seeing or even completely blind folks can play them. There's like a, a few games designed specifically for that and other games with like some pretty good pretty good like audio design for that. Uh, I think we should do that and then just like remove the audio as well. Um what and like also fuck up the visuals so that they don't work it's just like show noise on the screen or something um and then we should put needles on everyone's keyboards <laughs> we should make all keys spiky spiky in like a painful way not in like a you know satisfying the, the first all haptic feedback game <laughs> it's not much of a game it's more of an experience the experience isn't very pleasant the fuck, where the fuck do I go it's not this one I'm more than halfway through these textures and I'm worrying that Bong isn't here uh, hey you want to know what I have to do with this portion I have to use Florentine's what? journal on the flames. You're burning his fucking journal? No, the flames just get extinguished for some reason. I don't know why. That's- why is that the puzzle? You know, this game has done a pretty good job of just, like, not having puzzles. That one? I don't know about that one. Maybe it says something in Florentine's journal about it. I read it! I don't think it did. Some offhand comment about the journal putting out flames, something flowery, prosy. Fucking, I don't know. Ah! Wait, Man, I miss, I miss my cool sword. Man, did you get rid of it? The fucking dude stole it. Oh, right. I forgot already. I didn't. I miss my sword so much. <laughs> There's so many enemies. It's like a huge area, so I can just kite them, but it's like... It's... Oh god, there's so many fucking guys. I'm doing some fucked up shit right now to strafe while moving and also shoot, by the way. Because this is... Cause you have to use your... You have, like, mouse aiming, right? And also, yeah. you can't change the weapons with the mouse wheel, so you have to hit the number keys from 1 to 5. So, like, if I could get a keyboard cam right now, it would be absolutely hellish. Because this is fucking... My pinky is on the left, like, on the less than sign. You know the less than? The... Key you hit to yeah. press comma. So my left my left pinky is on the comma symbol. My left index finger is using the arrow keys to move. My right hand is on the mouse, and then occasionally my right hand has to move from the mouse to the two to five keys to change my weapons. <laughs> that sounds 
awful. My left hand is currently stretched to its limit. I think the controls of this game might be maybe its worst attribute. One of, I would say. Oh my god. <sighs> Thank you for following, Brilitzer. It's got some sort of liquid. Yes. Rumors that are we're so close to our 750 followers goal. It's only been an hour and a half. When, like, I feel like this stream, like, we're already up to, like, chapter 16. Nothing. 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 <laughs> <laughs> great. Not a great joke for me and Echo only. Did, is it just for us? I, I mean, we did play the Dame Was Loaded on this uh, stream, like, uh, months ago. Yeah, and he did already reference it in the stream. That's true. So... I go to the left. There's some stuff up there, and there might be like items. And then I go back, and then go to the right. Go on that way. Riley, can you look at an overlay chat real quick? Sure. That's great. Thanks. Thanks for that one. I found the uh, the chair from last stream. Shout out to the last FMV stream where there was a chair with a face on it. Yeah, a really fucked up chair face. I have scrolled through all of the textures and I have not found... You've not found Bong? I've not found Bong. That's so fucking sad. I don't understand. <gasps> Where's Bong? I would like wonder if textures can have like multiple layers. So maybe there's a texture with variants, except like there are like 12 clock textures. Oh, I see. For each hour on the clock. And then there's 12 more for some reason, even though it looks like the same clock. Okay, so this is the weird triangular bit. So... If I go up here, then to the left... That leads, uh... Eventually goes back around. I should just go through here. Then to the right, I think. I think? Okay, no, I can't go. Oh, no, I can't go through here, but it doesn't actually lead to the place I want to go to. That just leads to down here. So it's actually the inverse of what I thought it was. So this does. No, this does go where I want to. Because it just. Ah!
I'm out. Did you, oh, did I, okay, did I kill him? No, I just ran, I just, I just left. Ah! Stop doing that. I love that these monsters, like, don't seem to be able to, like, turn without, like, doing a full arc. It's really funny. Ah! Not a good region to fight one of these guys. Two of these guys, even less! This sucks. Why did I leave them into the tunnels? Oh my god, that was such a good shot. The mask and the traveler together. Come closer. Come. 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 Come closer. <laughs> um. <laughs> I accidentally got him to just say, come, come. Come, 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 come closer. The mask and the traveler are one together. The mask and the traveler. The mask and the traveler are one together. The mask and the traveler are one. Come. The mask and the traveler come. The mind, the face, come. Can someone clip that? Come closer. Walk on the mind the face with the soul traveler. We have fun here. We do. Hey, I should have saved. Oh yeah, it's be Fox and Puppy. It's be Fox and Puppy. Thanks, be Fox and Puppy. Glad you could make an appearance. Honored to have you on the show. Be Fox and Puppy. He needs some food in his tummy. Beep, beep, box, beep, I love that video. That's a great video. <sighs> okay, now I need to go to the other map. I really love the map interface in this game. Have I mentioned that? Have I mentioned that it has a great map interface? Yeah, you mentioned that a lot. And great and they're really easy to use. Okay, so I need to go yeah, to the really... right, and then go through the portal, and then go like that, okay. I really get the impression that you like the map interface a lot. Yeah, I do. It's really... The way that you talk about it. It's really good. Like the tone of voice. Yeah. Oh shit, more potions! Green potions. potions. Come on. Come on. Don't I give me hate green. more potions. Don't be giving me green potions.
I mean, I can just chill. Oh, never mind. Oh god, there's a guy behind me. Oh god. I tried to move backwards, but I couldn't, because there was a guy behind me. That was so scary. That's so sad. And there to die upon the hill. Take him! No, I won't die upon this hill. Yes, that's the hell you're dying on, huh? There we go. I was chatting my room. Are we playing Hexen now? Nope, we're playing Realms of the Haunting. It's just we're in the the haunting realm, the tower. This portal doesn't go. This portal doesn't go anywhere. It's a trick portal. It's a trick portal. Can you believe this? Why I yawn? Travel, look to the west, and there he shall find. Okay, now never mind. It's the right portal. Well, I guess let's go. Yes, it's magical. Let's save again, just to be safe. Hey, I think we might be near the end of the game. Yeah? Well, we're about to enter Sheol, so... I think we just have, like, boss oh. fights. We have chapter 17, 18, 19, 20. Whoa, that was a scary portal. It looked like it wasn't going to be a portal, but then it was. Doesn't appear to be working. What do you mean it doesn't appear to be working? My name? My name is Hate Manchild. My name is Hate Manchild. <laughs> that's a bad that's a kind of a shit name. Hi, nice to meet you. I'm Hate Man Child. My friends call me Hater. Run and jump across the gap. I have to jump across this gap. <gasps> I was like thinking that I had to do that, but I was like, no, nah, no, nah, it's not gonna make me do platforming. It already has, so what am I talking about? Yeah, it's been making you do platforming. Oh, come on. There we go. I love how ammo management kind of ceased to be a thing. I feel like... Like, I feel like it's maybe good to have one of my ammo weapons equipped, just for the sake of, like... It's like, I have eight pistol magazines, but it's just like, man, the, the charge up stuff does way more damage, it feels like. 
Yeah, because you can switch between them. Yeah. It's like by the and also the blunderbuss just recharges so quickly that it's like, why would I need to? It's like a hero having trouble managing weapon swap, I imagine. Oh shit! The cool sword is back, baby. Baby, let's fucking go. Now we're gaming. My favorite sword. Painstakingly, pixel by pixel, I have done the impossible. <laughs> have you recreated Bong? I've recreated Bong! Oh, that was scary. The color sampling. Pixel by pixel. Hey, we're in Sheol, but it looks kind of like... It looks fine. Hey, Echo, why does Sheol look so nice? Like something from Dante's comedy. What do you mean, like something from Dante's comedy? This looks fine. It looks nice. Strange symbols. Indeed. Gates of Shoal. Travelers, where are you found? <laughs> I am Abaddon, keeper of the keys of the, the sky. Know that I have dominion here. Know that only I possess the power to grant passage through the gates of Shoal. Perhaps you could tell us something about this place in which we stand. This grove in which you stand is hallowed ground. It is against all law to spill blood within this sanctum. Can you tell us anything about the worlds beyond the gates? I can tell you nothing. You must enter. There is no other way. We come in search of the soul stone. Know then that the arch will take you there. Step forward. Enter. Step forward. Forget talking. Let's fight. What? What? I can fight him? Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. We have enemies who stand against us. There have been three. Who were they? Names are of no importance. Oh, come on. Their signatures were lies, hope, and abandon. Signatures? Every soul has a signature, yet few can perceive them. The liar must be Belial. Hope, I think, must be Hawk. And abandon must be Gaul. It is against all law to spill blood within this sanctum. My blood, above all others, cannot be spilt here. Your actions are noted. <laughs> oh no, that's scary. <laughs> I've got the bad ending now. Ready as I'll ever be. We are ready to pass through the gate to the three worlds beyond. Go unto the realms of beyond. Eternity beckons. We did it, guys. We made it to the realms of the haunting. Oh, scary. Now I'm in fucking. Devil daggers. Rebecca. Rebecca. Damn, where is she? You hear the like crackling of the spider from Devil Daggers appearing? God. 
This is actually kind of a kind of a spooky locale. Yeah. I love this like architecture. What are these tunnels for? This is the spider zone. Oh! I got jump scared by like the music on cue with a guy just appearing. Ah, it's Ooh. Alien from Alien! That's a fucking dog. I love these things. That's such a cool guy. What the fuck is it? What the hell is that? That's a brain. Brain? Yummy. Delicious brain. I love receiving brain. I'm imagining me rolling my eyes. I'm imagining it. Oh my god! Well... <laughs> time to go get some brains! That's so... Yeah, you gotta go into the fucking mines, Riley. Oh my god, there's a guy. Oh, there's a funny dog. This sword is great. I don't know what that fucking person was talking about. They probably only used the ranged attack? Alright, well, let's go, let's go get some brains. I think these... Some of the hottest mods in this game so far. <laughs> I'm trying to think of other mods. I'll, I'll, I'll agree to that. They're definitely, like, like, one of the coolest designs. They're, like, smiling. They're, they're fucking... Yeah, they got that Those like Ridley, Ridley, that like Ridley vibe, like Ridley Xenomorph. Yeah. yeah, they got the fucking like lair too. Like, gotta have a fucking the spider web lair. That's like a really cool zone. Yeah. Oh god. It's fine. Oh okay, they're below me. Don't uh fall. <laughs> right when I say it. Okay, these guys died pretty quickly to the sword, at least. Love the penis music. You... Is this penis music? A little bit penis music to me. It's just like a jam. I like this song too. I love I love this fucking game's music. This game is like yeah. I'm usually like yeah, this is some pretty good MIDI music, you know. But this game is like no, these are fucking actual box. Yeah, like, like and this is with the default MIDI sound font too. Like unless it has a custom MIDI sound font inbuilt, like this is just with the deep. Like I'm not using my good MIDI's right now because you like you can't hear those. This is just like default MIDI's. Like, yeah, it's really. I, it sounds like it's, it sounds like it's designed for like, default midis or at least similar default midis to this. Sleepy. I'm so glad it's another maze. Yeah, me too. It 
it's so convenient that like when something's in your face, you can just fucking thwack it. Yeah. You got a sword. How do I get to that part? It looks like Brain Riley. I don't remember it's a brain. There is a there is a texture in here called Flesh One that is just the color red. Oh, okay, you just have to jump. I could bet. be like here, and I don't know what I'm supposed to do from here. I bet the reason the texture isn't in this wad is that like it's associated with entities like the enemies. Mm. It's not like an actual map texture. of this like it's a cool segment but did it really need to be that many brains that's just what i'm thinking yeah about. i think it did the problem with this maze being like completely unrecognizable is that i have no fucking clue where i'm going and like where i've been Seems alive. Something's telling me to concentrate. Odd. Oh, okay. of this heart. Okay, so this is one I've already been into. There are apparently four of those caves. So I've been to two of them. caves that I haven't been into. Oh. I love that co the corpse just sank through the floor. I don't. I miss the corpse. I wish it would come back. 
forever. <laughs> Goodbye, gentle corpse. My good friend, my old friend. Huh. Here's a secret brain. Do they have enough brains yet? Because my hunch is no. Let me just try going back and see if we have enough. I have not been this way. I feel like you can make a good Realms of the Haunting AMV. Just like with the FMV cutscenes, I'm just thinking about it. Hypothetical Realms of the Haunting AMV. Yeah, like a fan cam. That's one. Is there only one in this room? There's only two. I think the, the heartbeat might just be there to make you, to like, lead you to these rooms, maybe? I have no idea. That's one, I still need four more. The remaining four brains are in the dead ends of two tunnels which run north to south of the either side of the chamber between the rectangle and the central chamber. Okay, so I need to go more inwards and try and find these dead ends. Okay. can do it, Riley. Thanks. I can. Theoretically. I believe in you. I'm sure there was like a map. Okay, here we go. That's two out of four. Ah, 
three. One more. Yeah, these dead ends are actually not that hard to find, because they're just, like, all on the lower levels of the maze. Mm, yeah. So you just kind of have to wander around until you find them. This is honestly not too bad of a maze. Uh, like, it's at least fairly, like... I like the mechanic of the heartbeats leading you to the secret rooms, and, like, it's mostly, once you figure out, like, where the caves are, it's... Like, I think it's a little repetitive, but, like, uh, jury's out on whether that's a pro or a con in a maze. Like, kind of, like, a good thing if you want a maze to be, like, difficult, but, like, it's not, like, a good way of... And I honestly don't know that much about maze design, because I'm not a maze fan. I'm a maze aficionado. I don't know what, like, a good... what constitutes a good maze. I think one that's, like confusing intuitively like you you really have to like put effort into into knowing into like remembering where you are because like yeah. ideal in a maze is you get lost yeah that's what i think they're for yeah that's kind of the point but i feel like there should be some way of being able to like map it out that's like not just literally drawing the path that you're taking like I feel like having landmarks is good. One, oh my god, I need one more. I'm missing one more. Nowhere? Line. Back in the mines. So we back in the mines. So we back in the mines, like... Um... Call me Steve, because I'm back in the mines. Sure. The children yearn for the mine. This is true. I have no fucking clue where there's lost brain is. This is bad echo. I have no idea where that lost brain is, because I got two from each I went to four of these rooms. I got two from each until except for one. And then I got the four that were in the main room. Oh, finding, having, like, trying to find the lost piece of a puzzle like this is always the worst part. It's like, yeah. you have to just do the whole thing again. Cause it's like, well, I don't know where it went, because I'm pretty sure I got everything, but apparently not. I don't think it's any of the dead end frames, because I got all of those. So I found one while we were searching for other frames, and then I found the other three just now. So it would have to be- but I definitely got two from all of these buildings, too. So I guess it would, like, it should have to be in the, like, main central amphitheater. Or, or there's a cave that I've missed, but I'm pretty sure I got all those big caves. I hope this is engaging, engaging stream content right now. I'm sure it is. If anyone complains, we'll just send them to hell. Yeah, and then you'll be stuck in the maze. Here it is. Just missed it. Just missed 
in it. No, actually. There are no disembodied brains in this. I'm sad. What did that do? Oh, it did that. Oh, this is- Oh! This guy is so big! This is the biggest guy I've fought so far. No doubt. Do you think I can stagger him with his sword? Die, fair beast! <laughs> Good lord, he just fucking died. The sword's fucked up. This did what you said. What the hell? Let go, damn you! Listen, it can be as it once was. Forget the boy. Hey, what the hell? It is nothing. It is all falling into place. Hey, I got this cool. What the hell's going on here? Ah! Bites. <laughs> he was fucking beaten by the a bite attack. <laughs> it's fucking Florentine. Tell him he has a trait for a companion. Tell him Rebecca J. Yeah. Yeah, it said this. It said it in the journal, dude. I already figured this out. <laughs> I couldn't tell you, I didn't think you'd trust me. Well, I don't trust you now! What are you talking about? For many years, I was Florentine's disciple. His mistress. Those letters, they were from me. To him. You? And him? <laughs> <laughs> I hate this man's face. Don't don't laugh at me like that. Son of a bitch. I don't know. Get off me. Okay, Adam. She actually, like, I would, like, I think. She... I think she's, like, pretty fair. Like, I wouldn't be that, like, I'd be mad at her for lying to me, but not for, like, what she did many, many, like, that's, like, it's, like, dude, we all make mistakes. Yeah. It was a long ass time ago, and yeah. it looks like she's trying to make it better. What the hell? That's me! Evil me! Evil me? What the fuck? Oh my ah. god, this shit's so good! I love FMB. It says that at the beginning of the game! There's a quote that says that at the beginning of the game. Oh, evil skull! Evil skull! This is mess. You can't deny. Yeah. I mean, there's been a lot of skeletons. There seems to be a form within the light. He's kind of, it's kind of short. Come on, Riley. Oh, it's fucking Mysterio from Spider-Man. What are you doing here, bro? Got a lot of fucking health. This is a real boss fight. Is this guy? Can you kill this guy? Is it if possible I kill, this, to kill guy? this guy? He doesn't seem to take any damage. But also, we've thought that before. 
Yeah, we have built that before. Oh. Well, you fucked up the top finding, so... Okay. Okay, now I gotta run away. Oh! Oh! Oh, no, there's more of them. <laughs> They're mirror guys. They're the wrong mirror. I have to break the mirrors? Oh my god. Oh my god. There's so many of them. It's a maze, except instead of any actual branching paths, it's just mirrors for those guys. Go on that one! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, this is the worst possible thing that could have happened. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna... Let's get a redo on that one. Let's get a rewind a little bit. Good lord, they do so much damage and you can't kill them. I need my gun for this one. Because, like, it's so much easier to shoot the mirrors if you can. Because that's, like, gotta be how you kill them, right? Okay, no more guys. Guys defeated. Perfect. There's apparently supposed to be fireball traps in this room, but they were not. I hate mirrors. You know, if you hate him so much, why don't you fucking marry him? Oh, Got some Riley slander in the chat. What the fuck? Oh, this is because you. Uh, yeah, that was a video about um, the me forgiving Rebecca, and I just think I'm like a decent person. I I like I do love women. I think it applies. Like... I think it. I think it applies to this mirror situation as well. <laughs> Why would I hate mirrors if I love women? Every time I look in the mirror, I see a woman. Well, not these mirrors. Oh, that's true. Oh. Never got to see Mysterio from Spider-Man? Oh, don't worry, there's plenty of him. 
Yeah, this green purple guy. He has four arms. This guy has four arms, which Mysterio is not known for, but also purple and green. Where's their snow globe heads? That's also true. They are also unkillable and very scary. The Syria is unkillable because he's an illusionist, and so you think you killed him, but you failed. That's true. So in that way, they're quite like Mysterio. Yeah, apparently there's like a hand symbol somewhere in here. Snow is walking menacingly on you, and I think that's good. I'm scared. I support you, Snow. Me. And this just leads back to the fucking entrance. What the hell? What the fuck am I supposed to do here? This is a mirror maze. Just find the hand symbol, click on it, and find your way out again. That's not a good walkthrough. I'm gonna be honest, that's a piss-ass walkthrough. That's one line for this maze. Fuck you. Makes sense to me. I don't know what your problem is. I think it's fine. You just find the, you just find the hand. The object is to go in, find the hand, switch person, and come back out. I got conflicting solutions for this. Gremlin's official cheat says to put your shoulder to the left wall going in and the right wall coming out. But both Lou and Nick said to do the opposite, right ear and left ear. There's no maze, though. Like, I don't get what I'm missing, because it doesn't feel like there's a maze here. It feels like there's just a bunch of separate mirrors. Like, I don't see the puzzle here. So I guess I'll just leave and come back here later. I just like fucked up irreversibly. Like, what? You're probably fine. There seems to be a fool. I imagine they would mention it if that was possible. Are you here to finish what you started, Florentine? My captivity is fruitless, Florentine. The prophecy Goodbye. will be fulfilled. Goodbye, Snow. Another will come to take my place. I'm talking to you, Florentine. Answer me. I'm not Florentine. 
My name is Adam Randall. So you are he. Your coming fulfills the prophecy. What do you mean? You are known, Adam Randall, as is the woman with whom you travel. Are you... a bad man? I am Abaddon, keeper of the key of the... Eve corrected him. <laughs> How do you know about Rebecca and myself? It was said that two would come to this place in mankind's greatest hour. That with eternity in hand, they would restore the balance or destroy it. Until this juncture, the woman's name was hidden to protect her, but yours, yours was known on the day eternity was taken from the stone. Okay. Because you got no privacy then. She gets some fucking privacy, but you're out here like yeah. chopped liver, huh? <laughs> I'm out of here. This guy's a nut bar. This guy's a fucking nut bar. <laughs> Key to the abyss. The key is the three tests and the arch which brought you here. Passage into Sheol is the result of possession of the key. Why does the soul stone need a guardian? My role is that of witness and vigil. I do not defend nor protect, for the stone needs not such. But my time is gone, Adam. The role of guardian will be another's after this day, as prophecy dictates. Seems like a bad system. The shit that's happening. Yeah. Who knows about me? It's kind of inefficient. All life in the universe is connected to the soul stone. You are connected to prophecy by the thread. The thread is a web of strands that touches each one of us. You, Adam, are connected There's so many fucking proper nouns. To you. you create rather than flow with the current. What is this place? Where am I? These are the halls of doppelgangers. <laughs> Demon of insight and personality. I've met something. He looked just like me. Naturally, all who come here must meet themselves. If you have any chance of success, you must destroy the darkness all men have in their hearts. Well, sounds simple enough. Do you have any ideas? The test must be passed by you, and you alone. Hey, dick fuck. Light. This red light, does it bind and... you here? I am held here by the light, yes. I do not fight against it. My only concern is Florentine's humiliation. Then you knew this would happen. Internment was prophesied for my soul. The light and Florentine are variables. Internment was the constant. Well, is there some way I can free you? You cannot. I must remain here if prophecy is to be fulfilled. What is this? Oh my god. Okay, so the the guide I was walking was reading was actually not at all relevant to what I was doing. Oh my god. I had to go back I had to talk to him and then go back through the archway, obviously. Oh Jesus, dude. Finally doing something. You have a job to do.
Hawk. That girl that was with me, Rebecca. Have you seen her? No. She is beyond my perceptions. Be careful. Where are you going? The chamber of the Soul Stone. I must meet with Gaul and await the gathering. It happens once, every 1,000 years. For so many lifetimes and realities, the gathering has passed without notice. Now the seventh and last seal quakes. The touch of a mortal. A mortal who dares bend the law to himself. It looks like Florentine's going to win, doesn't it? If he does, the ultimate power of darkness will manifest within the shell that is Gaul. Only you have the power to stop this. But be warned, for you also have the power to perpetuate it. The fate of the world has begun. Florentine started it. You will complete it. You and the sword. I must go now. I have been delayed for too long. We will meet again. I guarantee it. Brother of oh, lies. Brother. This shit stinks. Oh my god. Okay, so... Talk to the figure. There are three tunnels leading from this room inside of 16 mirrors. As you approach each mirror, when your reflection becomes visible, monster runs towards you. You cannot kill them. What you have to do is fire at the mirror before you're attacked. Uh. Oh, okay, so you do have to break all of the mirrors. Okay, I was just reading the wrong walkthrough section. I love how I have to go back through this arch like three times. Yeah, it's really riveting. Oh boy, Echo, we're in it now. We're in puzzle zone now. Puzzle time start. This has some uber vibes, I'm not gonna lie. Not like actually, but... I see some tiles you can walk on with a low ceiling, and I I get flashbacks. How the fuck are you supposed to know the right order? Like, what is supposed to signal that? Oh. These nuts. Thanks. Got him! Fuck. Just kind of guessed it. Yeah. That doesn't look right. I have to... I have to walk across this green slime. Oh my god. Oh, Echo, I have to go shoot all those mirrors again. Enjoy! Oh boy. Oh. Aging 1,000 years. Why is this the puzzle? Deaths. Like, why is this the means of progression? Do you meet?
Okay, broke all the mirrors. Let's talk to this guy. We. Do you ever think that like auto saving might have been good? Place? Yeah, I think it was one of video games' best uh, inventions. Wow, <laughs> that's high praise. Just like a good feature for video games to have, I think. Okay, so I do have to break the mirrors in this room as well. I love how there's no signal that you've done what's necessary until you walk up to the throne. Of course. Then you walk backwards would... through the arch. Why would they tell you anything? That sounds ridiculous. Puzzle time start. Puzzle time. Start. So this is a What the fuck is this? I don't know what this is. It's a weird dice. The object is to get the bullet to ricochet off each spear, spear in turn and finally exit via the square at the top left. If you want to work this out for yourself, the way I did it was to draw a chart showing the position of each spear and then number them. Then by trial and error, find out which switch controls which sphere. Oh, then work out which position it. causes the bullet to ricochet onto another sphere. There's only one correct position for each switch. I fucking love video games. Genuinely, they're beautiful. Video games are a beautiful thing. They explode into lemons. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. It didn't ricochet at all. Okay, so maybe they revised that puzzle in this version of the game, because it seems like I just did it. By shooting it. Hmm. Seems suspicious. The bullet definitely didn't ricochet. Oh yeah, see, the force field is gone here. So yeah, I did do it. Okay, so they made that puzzle not suck. That's nice. I'm glad that my warp through is not no longer reliable. Was it ever reliable, Riley? Uh, that's true. Good point. Alright. <laughs> okay, this isn't actually that bad. To like make a paw for a month. This is actually I like this kind of puzzle.
guy tried to take a bite out of the lemon, but it was too sour. Oh no. Sky, you've fallen for one of the classic blunders. Fallen for one of the classic blunders. Okay, so it's like, this one is those five and that one. Oh my god, I'm gonna just have to get a pen and paper out to fucking record this. Oh, yeah, yeah. I no longer like this puzzle. And now I like it. Because I don't. Yep. Yeah, figures. I've given up being coy. <laughs> I fucking hate you. <laughs> <laughs> So there's seven switches, and there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve blocks. So one moves blocks two through two to. Three, four, five, six. And moves blocks eleven. Two moves one, four, five, seven, eight, and ten. One. You think actually this is Morps code? I don't think it's Morps code. I don't know what that is. You mean Morse code? One, two, three, four, eight, and then eleven and twelve. So two, four, eight, eleven, twelve. Six, nine, ten, twelve. Ten, eleven, and two and three. And seven moves one, three, five. One, three, five, seven, nine. 11. Just every odd number. <laughs> Delicious. So I need to move block 3. So from here I need to move blocks 3, 5, 6, 7, and 12. Three, five, six, seven, and twelve. Six and twelve go from that one. A nine or ten or no? No. It's only one that moves nine. Oh, well that works. I love the fucking old explosions, like, meme explosion sound. Yeah. Okay, now I have to move every single block, which is a bad place to be in, I feel like. Just thinking about that beam explosion sound again. Yeah. 
Hi, Andrea. Uh, well, you can see that I'm in puzzle hell. I have noted down what all these switches do, I'm just also not very smart. Is the problem. Don't say that, Riley. Your puzzle brain is unparalleled. Yeah, but like, this is a real, like, I have to think of, I have to like plan out a sequence of levers to pull, and that's just like, does not gel with my brain. Hmm, look at that. Okay, so this is four, it's five, six, seven, nine, twelve. Now it's five. Nine, ten. Hmm, no, there's an easy one from there. So, I should go 5, 6, 7, 9, 12. Now it's 6, 9, 10, and 12. Oh, hey, I did it. Yippee! Well, that's... Yippee! What does that do? Didn't, uh, didn't seem to do very much at all. There's still that force field. Now we shoot them. Oh, presumably I have to come here from the other side. Then it's fun. Pretty easy to do in reverse order, though, now that I figured it out. <laughs> Ow. I think I just have to, like, run past. Ow. Oh, I didn't actually take damage from that. Ow. Ow. Oh my god. Fuck me! <laughs> Echo! I died on a fireball trap, so it's just exploding me forever! <laughs> This? <laughs> I want you to know I am just quietly smiling at them. It was not laughing, I'm simply I'm simply looking, I just This is beautiful. This is true art. This is classics of game. This is a real classics of game. Hey, can you do anything about this? Can, can you like, reload my save? save. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you died. Yeah. Here. I just wanted to leave it on there for like a while. I thought it was funny. It was pretty funny. This is like such a stupid puzzle. <laughs>
explodes you into lemons. So I was at a funeral on Saturday, and I watched a 7-year-old shoulder tackle a 130-year-old tombstone and snap it clean and ha? Huh? Yeah? <laughs> That's that... <laughs> kind of a gnarly wedding. What the fuck was going on? Why did that no, it happen? A, it was a funeral, not a wedding. But Funeral, same thing. Um... <laughs> Quite different. Uh... Kind of anyway, depends on which end. Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, that's fucking hilarious. Uh, that's a jacked toddler. <laughs> like, you gotta be... Toddlers are kind of jacked. Yeah, like, that's a buff-ass toddler. What if there's, like, a really easy solution to this when you start? No, there isn't. Oh, hey, now I can do it for me. Nice. The Wait, I forgot. So much easier. Yeah. I feel that. Yeah. A pleasant, a pleasant distraction. Uh. But you could use a pleasant distraction right about now. You know, you're not wrong. Okay, that works. <laughs> I don't want to do Fireball Trap Room right now. Uh, 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 uh. Mm hmm Yeah? Mm -hmm. Are you having fun? Mm hmm This is, yeah? Okay. Yeah, sure. Um, okay. Sure. Yeah. I'd love to hear it. Wow, well, yeah. Why? Glad you're having fun. Why is that? Why is that how it is? Huh? Why is this? Why is this how it is? Well, you see, that's just how it is. It seems to be like that. I think I did it. I 
should save because I feel like I'm gonna get uh, exploded if I touch that floor. Exploded you? Nah. Game wouldn't do that to you. Not after all that puzzling. Whenever I'm doing this, I'm imagining I'm like crawling along the ground like a beetle. Yeah, I hope you are. I hope that's canonical. It, it is to me, my beautiful mind. Oh, okay. Oh my god, Minecraft. What? I don't know, but that's what Sky said. I think Sky saw us cube and was like, wow, it's just like my video game, Minecraft. Sky's, Sky's always video. doing this. It's yeah. Sky's favorite video game. It was Minecraft. For context for everyone else. Yeah, in case you didn't know. This one, it's like... Go up to here, go around here, go around here, go up through here. Fuck! Oh my god. evil slime time, so I saved. <laughs> Whoops, wrong thing. What is... What is this? Supposedly he's supposed to shoot this. Are we sure? No idea. Now walk forward and touch a hand symbol. The tile floor turns to green slime and a force field buys your exit. Run across this slime and shoot the force field as you run. I... So you turn it into slime by shooting it, maybe? And then you can go through while it's slime? Oh, uh, maybe, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think that's it. I'm such a genius. You are truly a puzzle master. Wow. High praise coming from you. Yeah. Uh. Um. Yeah. Uh! Scary. Oh, weird mirror maze. It's a dead end. No, it's not. Yes, it is. This is a cool maze, even if it is extremely nauseating. Maybe not extremely, but a little bit. For me, I'm personally sensitive stomach. 
Yeah, it's pretty nauseating. The S Blade has a half blood charge. Here's to the ladies. <laughs> oh, okay. Yes, that's a Slayer's, Slayer's X reference. This is really just a maze-ass maze, huh? There's a lot of dead ends. Yup. Appears to be. You guys have the amazing maze and maze? You probably don't, because you probably have more porn mazes than that. But there's a place in, I think it's a place in New Zealand called Amazing Maze and Maze. It might, it probably isn't still functioning. I just remember seeing ads for it as a child. It was a corn maze. But it was like the amazing Ooh. maze in maze with an eye. Mmm, yeah. Whoa! I did it! Whoa! You did it! Oh, uh, now I have to fucking get out. Getting out is the hard part. Yeah, it seems like it. Okay, no, I'm making... Oh, no, never mind. Oh, no, yep, yep, yep. Making headway. I think. Good lord, it's so dark and scary now. Why is it so dark? Oh, god, I'm really fucking lost, Echo. Oh, I'm really... I'm really lost in this mirror maze. It's... <laughs> oh, sweet release! I have escaped. That's a little sad. Sorry. Okay, but check this shit out. Come on, Echo. Come on, Echo. You can't be sad that we're in the orb room. Ooh, mm, but I can. But the echo check out these orbs. Here's the bullet ricochet puzzle. Hey Riley. <sighs> You're gonna have to destroy some floating mines. Okay, so this is actually not that bad, because it's like, so these correspond, this 4x3 graph just corresponds to this 4x3 graph, and then you just, like, so this one you want to go, can you go back up? No, okay, so you want to go directly to the left, and that one you want to go... Hmm. 
Maybe you want to go with this one, you know, the one. up every time it hits it, but it can't hit that one and that one. Yeah. You would think you would do that. There's a corn maze in every other town in the U.S.? That makes sense. Yeah. There's a lot of corn mazes. There's a lot of corn. You're right. Not happy about it. genuinely don't understand how you're supposed to hit two things in the same height level because it moves up every time it hits one. I don't get it. I can't even parse how this walkthrough is right now. Because it's like, there's only one correct position for each switch. It should not take too long, but if you can't be bothered to go through all that, here are the correct positions for each switch numbered clockwise from one, assuming one to be the 12 o'clock position. And this bo bottom one in the right hand most third row is seven on the walkthrough. Where is seven on this 12 o'clock symbol? Is it here? I guess it's here. That's not where seven is on a clock. That sure is not where seven is on a clock. That's that's sure not. You see, Riley. If you put about... if you put seven, if you put it where seven would be, it's here, and you that see, just goes this you, way. Well, you see, Riley, the thing about clocks is they're not divided into eight segments. Yeah. Why did you do it twelve o'clock? <laughs> Why did you name it? Like, what? 
Did he mean seven? Maybe he just meant seven. But that also doesn't go anywhere. Oh, I didn't realize I could shoot them out so quickly. Puzzles didn't have to make sense back in the day. Go play Mist. <laughs> How the fuck do you get this thing to ricochet off things that are on the same height? Because it immediately ascends whenever it hits a thing. I genuinely don't get it. I don't understand. It cannot hit two things on the same height level. But it's supposed to hit all of them, right? I would assume. It... Unless you just want to get it into that gap up there. You're supposed to hit it off each sphere and to get it into that gap. Maybe they revised this puzzle? Oh well, no, they didn't actually revise that puzzle. I just misunderstood which puzzle it was. Oh, wait, whoops. You literally don't ha I don't know what this walkthrough is talking about. Here are the correct positions for each switch numbered clockwise from 1, assuming 1 to be the clockwise posi- the 12 o'clock position. Top row. Top row. Well, fuck, I already did it. But 1-1-5-1. One, one, one. What? Completely- Dog shit walkthrough! What are you talking about? This is why you gotta figure out puzzles yourself, Riley. Yeah, because so nobody else knows how to fucking do them, apparently. Hey, I love this hypercube over here. This, like... This Terrifying. fucking... Scary green cube. What do these hand switches do? What? Oh, I see. I see if you can. Oh, okay. Middle Gear Solid Metal. VR mission is like an ass cube. Yeah, real. Hey, this is bad. This is a bad puzzle because I can't fucking see it. I think it's, uh, interesting. Is it? It looks neat. Yeah, it's aesthetically cool. It's, like, not good in terms of puzzle. Well, that's up to a sort of uh, subjectivity, I think. If you want something to be good, then, uh, well... Can you tell me to go play this? No. You weren't about to tell me to go play Mist? I wasn't. Okay. Sorry for disappointing you. Yeah. Oh, Echo! I'm in hell. 
It's just like the switch, the levers puzzle, but way worse because I can't, like, I have to just go around and check what each switch does manually. Like, I can't just look at it from a distance. Like, it's just... These puzzles have only 32 combinations. That's true. That's true. That's pretty forcible. Look. I get into there. I get behind it. Is anything I know about Riley is that she's not above just brute forcing a puzzle. I don't know what else I'm supposed to do. Like, look how close I am. Riley? Look how close I am. Yeah. I'm not talking shit about you in this instance. I'm talking shit about you in the past. Oh, okay. I'm I'm doing a goof on past Riley. Rude. For those who don't know, Past Riley is an individual who uh, brute force a puzzle in a game for children that wasn't actually a puzzle because when you progress through the game oh, enough, right. uh, yeah. it just gives you the answer to the puzzle for free. Yeah, that's right. It was funny, though. It was pretty funny. You did encourage me to do it, so it's kind of your fault. I'm not claiming to be a good person. I'm just talking shit. I see. No, Post Riley still exists. Just, you know, in the form of, form of Del Me. Past Riley has become current Riley. Yeah. Current Riley isn't really better. Okay. Seems like this gives me a clear path if I can get in somehow. I'm so close, Echo. I'm so close. I believe you can do it. I do. And I'm not just saying that. I'm sure. I have faith that you're capable of 
completing that final plunge, that final little piece of the puzzle that you haven't quite placed into place yet. When you finally do it, I'll be here. Beatboxing puppy. Beatboxing puppy. I'll be here to tell you that I'm the beatboxing puppy. Lenny Puyo. Wow. It's a beatboxing Beat, puppy. Beatboxing puppy. <laughs> <laughs> Can't believe you have the beatboxing puppy live on stream. Beatboxing puppy. Oh, so <laughs> this puzzle sucks. It's a, such a bad puzzle. What if it was timed though? <laughs> Starting the timer now. <laughs> what happens to the timer goes off? You die. Oh, why? The nuclear bomb goes off, <laughs> Riley. Just count to 32 in binary. The problem is that I've, like, reset. Ugh. I just wish I could see all of the things that I'm doing at once. But you can't. You can't see all of the walls that you're changing at once. This is just a worse version of the other puzzle that it makes you do. It's like a gr red light, green light puzzle for perverts. <laughs> I... What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, I did it! You did it! Oh! Save. Awful puzzle. Worst puzzle in the fucking game. Good lord. It's time to save your game. I think I'm out of puzzles now, too. I think that was the last one. Yeah, now I just have to do... Okay, no, never mind. It was this one. Oh, yeah, this fireball trap puzzle that I still don't understand. Oh, no, wait, this is just... Hmm, hang on. Hmm. Apparently I'm supposed to be able to do this somehow, but I don't know how. Just hitting this button just makes this one fire. Okay, no, now it makes that one fire. Okay. What the fuck? What the hell? Sorry, you weren't allowed to do it before. Hope yeah. that's okay. I do also still have to do the fireball trap puzzle. Yeah, that's the fireball trap puzzle. But I've done all of the other ones, I think. 
I think this is like the biggest chapter before the end of the game. They just like really, uh, really wanted you to do a bunch of puzzles. Another one? Is there two left? No, I think it's just five. Yeah, it's just five old track puzzle. I'm gonna say it here again. What do you think the puzzle here is? Hmm? What do you think the puzzle here is? Oh, that's freaky. Well, you want to not get shot by fireballs is like the goal of the puzzle. Is that the goal well, of the, the information? Puzzle? I would assume so. It <laughs> happened again. I I think that's a, a primary goal. That you should be striving for. I feel like it's not very puzzling, though. Ancient free orange. Are there something in these little like holes? This one does not trigger fireball trap. That one did trigger a final trap. How do you keep getting shot in the face? I'm aware. God damn it. I think if I go fast enough, I can just dick do it. Have you ever tried not getting a shot in the face? Okay, no, that's how you even if you're standing off to the side. Okay, well, frankly, to this point, like, I don't want to do it and have zero health. Fuck. Is the goal to break all these mirrors? Ow. Well, fuck, at this point. Okay, at least, like, I have some sort of direction now. Okay, so there's that mirror. There's this mirror. Break this one. Break. I love the animation that plays where he is shooting a gun and he is not, in fact, using a gun. So, there's that mirror to break as well. Ow. Fuck. Fuck. Ow. Hmm. Huh. 
Big match. Hmm? He broke one and now a bunch of others are broken. Yeah. Okay, well that's not the right one. Whoopsies. Eh, bleh. It's, uh, eh, it's a bleh. That's me. I'm, I'm, I do that whenever I get exploded by fireballs. This is true. Okay, so that's another one. I can walk back across here. Walk back across here. Walk back across here. Yes. I'm going to save again because. It's the right thing to do. Oh god. Aha! Oh god. Fuck! No! Yes! I think this is the last one. Oh my god, I did it. Oh, I'm basically no health. I'm gonna reload. Yeah, now that you know how to do it. Yeah, because I don't want to have no help. Ow. Fuck me. It's not that one. Fuck, oh, I forget where it is. There it is, okay. Well, I took a bunch of damage, but not as much as last time. Whatever. I don't care that much. I have potions. Delicious. What the fuck is this for? Do I have, like, an item I could put here? It's not even interactable, so I can't use an item on it. Oh, Jesus Christ, fireball traps are still active. I didn't do the puzzle! What do you mean? What do you mean? Sorry. You didn't do the puzzle. Oh my god, you have to jump. Do you want to know what you have to do, Echo? What? You have to jump on this pillar! Since when? It. Since when is that been a puzzle mechanic? Absolutely. I'm... I'm human. Congratulations, you did it. You did the puzzle. Okay, now what do I do? <laughs> it's a puzzle, Riley, because they're doing new things and you have to figure them out yourself. Like the pillar that's conspicuous. Hmm, I wonder what we do with this in the puzzle.
When they say puzzle time start, hey. they mean it. Hey, Echo. Once you have solved all eight puzzles, go to the entrance to each room and click on the symbol and move the red dot to the six o'clock position. There is a specific order in which to do them, but I could not figure out what it is. So just keep going around until they are all done. Huh? Why would I move it to six? Why six? That's five or four. Okay, well, I guess you just click it and then it goes back, so. Really not. I'm sure we don't have to retrieve the puzzles. Is this the... Hang on, which one is this? This is... Where's Mirror Maze? Mirror Maze is... Eight. Okay, hang on. There's apparently, a like, a secret boss? Uh -huh. This is the Mirror Maze, right? Yeah, this is the Dark Mirror Maze. Okay, so if this is eight, then turn left and go to the next circle. So seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. I think. Let me just hang on. Let me go. Okay, so this is the puzzle I need to go to is the checkerboard puzzle, which is this one. Okay, so from this one, I make this one go dark. Then, counting circles and going left, skip the next one and go to circle four. to make this one not dark. So start at this one, set the next one, one, two, three, four. Skip the others until you come to circle. Eight. Five, six, seven, eight. So the mirror maze. Save before you click that click that one. What? Uh Arm the shotgun says. Oh, okay. I think I literally just have to turn them all to six. I don't know why this person did it in this weird specific order, but I don't actually think that's necessary. Okay. It's just that a guy gets summoned, and that's just what I was talking about.
The reason it suggests going back to the mirror maze is because it's one of those walkthroughs that's like, you don't have to fight the guys. You can just go and shoot them from between the doorway. Oh, yeah. You can fight the guys, though. Yeah, I'm strong. I'm good at video games. I feel like you've been going around this for a while. Yeah, I feel like I've kind of looped. Do you feel like it's like reset because you did it in the wrong order? Maybe so. Try going the other way around after this one. Okay, so... Yeah. It does seem like they alter each other somewhat. But I have no idea what the order is. Because I don't know how I would know that. Other than just like trying. Um, are there eight of them? Yeah. Didn't seem to fuck with that one. And move that one one. Moved that one not at all. So there's these two are linked. It seems. So what if I move what if I move this one? Does that move the other ones? No, it doesn't didn't, move that one. Doesn't move that one. It, it does move does. this one. And it moves this one. There's also no wait no that yeah that's the one that I just moved okay so then this it's really funny that the guide is like just like I just clicked on shit until it worked that's not a good puzzle solution it's like this puzzle has like clearly is like a whole puzzle it's like i don't like the perspective of it but this is a pretty normal just like similar similar to like a lights on off puzzle or something you know it's, yeah, it's just this a... is the one puzzle it's been doing over and over well three a little times. bit yeah. only three times only only as many times as the seventh guest has a chess puzzle that's uh well not that much does that mean you have to keep redoing the puzzles? No, I just have to do these dials. Oh, uh, this one has a natural solution though. So, click the dial until it goes dark. Then turn left and go into the next circle too. Press the dial till it goes dark. Now counting circles and going left. Uh, skip the next one and go to circle four. Press till it goes dark. Skip the others. Five, six, seven, eight. Hmm. I fucked it up because it's all like out of order. Wow. Well, I can just reload the um, post fireballs. I'm just gonna load blah. Yeah. Ugh, but it's still out of order is the problem. Like, once you fuck it up, once you, like, fuck with it, it's just, like, permanently altered. And the walkthrough yeah. is no longer helpful. Ooh. Okay, it seems like this is fine. And only... Okay, okay. All of them but one are dark. Is this the right one? No, but that's fucking whatever. I don't care. So this is... Which one is this? This two? No. So... One is dark. I gotta be right back. Okay. Not only am I dehydrated... But also, I'll see you soon. Okay. What? That sounds kind of ominous, Echo. 
It's, I just got a piss. See ya. Oh, okay. Oh boy, I'm in the hell zone. I'm gonna reload to before I fucked with any of these. Even if I have to redo a bit of the fireballs puzzle. Sprinting across the ocean would do the opposite of quench your thirst. Both because it's like salt water and also because you're sprinting. One, two, three. Okay, none of them are done. That means I can just go from the top. But it's salt water. It's salt water, this guy. It's not hydrating. made these fucking puzzles because if god did it i like why why do you do that I was gonna miss this. I also am gonna take a brief uh, bathroom break because uh, I want Echo to see this funny guy.
Hi, I'm back. Echo isn't back yet, though, and I'm not sure how long I'm willing to wait, considering it's been four hours already, and I'm very close to the end of the game, and I want to beat it. Man, I love that this website, this walkthrough I'm looking at is on a fucking Angel Fire website. Eh, fuck it. It's just a regular guy. To bottomless perdition there to dwell in adamantine chains and penal fire. What say you, Adam? Let's go. Stop that. Let's go. If you heard that knocking, that was Bosco kicking a box in my wardrobe because he was scratching himself right next to it. <sighs> Sorry about that. And now he's yelling. Yeah. What about it? Bosco. <sighs> Where do you go? There he is. Do you hold a flame for her then, Adam? Or is the fire extinguished? She betrayed you, you know that, don't you? Magical. Perdition shield. Wow. Hello, Reg and Raiders. Yippee. I got a scroll. Magical. Magical. My great co host Echo is nowhere to be seen. But the game awaits. Hey, I don't have a good name for this. Guess I just go this way, question mark? I don't think that's where I go. Do I just go back through the arch again? Uh... I should save here, I guess. Eh, it's fine. It's not that long ago.
Why is Shoal so nice? It's so nice all the time. Like, there is the one evil zone. Most of it's been pretty, pretty okay. Some old wall. Wonder what old battles were fought here. Potion. Two potions. Delicious potions. Oh, we're almost, almost done. Any more secret potions? Stop it. Tiny castle for gnomes. Tiny distant gnome castle. Hey, this place looks... I'm getting an awful familiar feeling from this place. But why? It's like I've somehow been here before. A long time ago. Hell, if I don't know what's going on. This is where I saw... I saw this place ages ago. see that like at the beginning of the game very early on at least fuck me now well there's no way down from here yep it's gonna die sad oh my god there's a fucking health vial right where you draw that's funny Okay, here we go. I wonder when Echo will return. Okay, so what's the this? I'm getting an awful familiar feeling from this place. But why? It's like I've somehow been here before. A long time ago. 
hell if I know what's going on. Hi. Hey, Echo. Uh, you didn't miss all that much. I fought a big guy with a flamethrower, and he gave me a scroll of perdition, which says it will protect me from purging fire. Um. Do I have to, like, use it? No, I can't. Well, it looks like you're in a nice, pretty interesting place. Yeah, I'm in the... I'm in Shoal or whatever. I got attacked by some demons, and I think this is like the boss arena. I got a bunch of health potions. Uh, hmm. Shall we finish the game, I think? Or something close to it? I hope so. Well. This ain't much of a it. Shoal, though. No, it's quite pleasant. Rebecca? Rebecca. Does Rebecca even qualify as like a damsel in distress? Oh boy. <laughs> you kind of just argued with her and now you're like, ah, I need to go find her. She's should tied I, up should I kill like, her? Well, should I kill her for her horrible crimes? No. Weren't you just saying that you think it's she's fine? Yeah. You don't yeah. think she did anything wrong? She's in the prophecy. I'm curious if you get, like, a bad end if you choose that other option. Not a great thing to smell. Indeed. What have you done with her? I have done nothing with her. Then again, why would you believe anything I said? You got that right. What now? I would have thought that to be most obvious. For no reason but this, you are going to die. Better do your best. Because if I'm going out, I'm taking you with me. I don't feel like these Scooches two guys away. have any chemistry. I don't feel like there's any chemistry between these guys. Yeah, it's kind of. I'm not feeling super, super passionate about this sort of like showdown. Yeah. Like, did I miss a part where they? Uh, uh, started caring about each other. It feels. I mean, a like he attacked. Field. He like imprisoned my dad, and then I read a bunch of books about how he was. He's like evil, and also he. We met him, and then he tried to blow me up. But then I attacked him with a dagger, and I like hit him with a dagger to escape. Yeah, but that just seems like a guy. I like. I feel like it. Like that. That guy. I read mostly read a bunch of books about him, and he also did some shit that I don't like. It'd be like, you're gonna die, and it's like, huh, okay. <laughs> like, I wouldn't be like, if I'm gonna die, I'm taking you down with me. It's like, no, I'm not gonna fucking die, dude. He's a chump. Fuck you. He's just gonna stand there and shoot, huh? Fucking turn based combat. He's shooting fast. Sure you shouldn't just hit him with a sword and stagger? Hey, he, he stole my sword again. He stole your sword again? What the fuck is the point of the sword? I didn't... I could have healed there. Oh, it auto saves you here. Okay, never mind. Oh no, I just saved there. That's right. I kind of want to see what happens if you leave her to her fate. Yeah. 
Do does I, like, keep it, Does it do sword? anything? Okay, so let me take these potions and let me go here, climb back up this tower for the third time because I already had to reload once because I fell into the pit in the middle of this tower. That's really funny. Oh my god, I see. Yeah. Just like, why is this tower designed like this? In universe and out of universe. What the hell? It's the end of the game, Riley. You gotta be. It's gotta be hard. New Year. Those lights. Seems to be something growing in the lights. Hmm. Two stars. From this place. Sort of. But why? It's like two... I've somehow been here before. Is it a long time ago? Huh. Hell, if I don't. You. You. You don't. You don't seem to have memories about this tower, at the top of which there are two stars just out of reach. <laughs> hmm, interesting. Shut up. Good bit. Um, another <laughs> joke for me and Echo. Uh, the thing about I like the... only making jokes today that don't make any sense. To anybody else. Yeah. I'm just being coy and like, hey, hey, the viewers will never know what I'm talking about. Yeah. This is good commentary. <laughs> <laughs> the, the thing about um, that tower is that you see that tree earlier in the game, like you see it through a force field, but you can't reach it. Don't really know why. Yeah, it's not, like, clear what's going on there. Yeah. The significance of that tree is kind of vague. I assume it's just, like, they take the star that one of you has to fall, so leaving her here is actually the way that you uh, get the normal ending. Maybe he gets stabbed in the back. Oh, there he is! Hey, I had that star! They just not this. Hey, 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 hey. What the fuck? I get to keep the sword if I don't try to save her. But also, you get no dialogue. <laughs> like, just get none at homeboy all. does not give a fuck. He's just like, they just stare at each other. There's, it's... like, I, ironically, it feels like there's more chemistry in that. They're just like, right? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> if you don't save her, you're gay. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Whoops. Whoopsies. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Is he like charging it up? No, he's not charging it up all the way. That shit ain't do any damage. I usually just hit him with the sword. Yeah, let's just go up and fucking fucking beat the shit out of him. Huh? <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck do you mean? What? What? <laughs> huh? <laughs> What happened? What happened? There is no armor against fate, Adam. Death lays his hands even on kings. Don't think you've won. Excuse me. I said, don't think you've won. 
It isn't a question of winning, Adam. It's a question of dying. And you are dying. So stupid. Have you ever thought of death? Adam, why are you still doing this? I thought you'd say that. <gasps> did he just fucking twist his nuts? I don't know what he did. But it's like... This is the gay ending. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> oh, I love this shit. Yeah! They didn't fucking use that scream. He stabbed him with climax. He stabbed no. him with Alf Stagger. Now you're right. You're down here? Cause I have to I still have to reload the game, Echo. Can't reload the game out of a cutscene. <laughs> okay, so that is just a death. Okay, but if I do this, can I just like not melee him with the sword? Does it not want me to do that? It seems like he just it just thinks he has the sword. I can, yeah, I can only get one hit on him before it just like kills me. It, I feel like that would happen when it ta he takes away the sword too. It's really weird that he just has the sword and he stabs. Yeah. Oh my god. And he stabs you. Yeah. <laughs> Distant. Ugh. God, I'm just, I want that cutscene of them staring at each other. I, I love that cutscene. I want that shit on my artistic YouTube channel. It's kind of a bad, it's kind of a bad fight. Yeah, he doesn't like move, you can just strafe it. The worst part of this fight is just changing your weapons. Huh? Okay. He's fucking dead. Don't worry about it. I did it. Oh, uh, this is. Well, it's it's good to know that you'll be able to do the other ending easily. I think he shoots think more he frequently. And in... huh? What did he say? Nothing hidden here. Oh, okay, she's just like gone. She's not there. Bye, girl. Bye, girl. Huh? Hmm? Should I just continue down this. continue in this doomed world I've created, or should I go back and save her? I don't really like this doomed world you've created. I, but also I do like. I feel like we should find I... out what happens before we do this. Yeah. I'll save here. Let's... I just won't save over that, and then I'll go load the wild site. Gotta get into strafing position. I think he shoots. Yeah. Yeah, he's slightly stronger in this one. What if there's actually no difference except that in one fight he's harder? And so just being a jerk is better. <laughs> That shit came out of nowhere on my screen. Yeah. Did it! Got him! He dropped something. Yeah, my frickin' sword. Oh my god, she's literally just gone. I mean, like, she is KO'd the whole time. Whatever you do to her doesn't actually affect... Yeah. I guess I guess she says something. She's like, Adam.
Careful. I love this fart music. Adam, I lied to you. My name is not Rebecca. It is Eve. We didn't know how to name Shut anybody up. in this fucking game. So we named the main character Dirt. <laughs> it's still the funniest shit to me that, like, Adam's a cool name. It's a solid name. I think, as far as, like, all boy names go, Adam's a good name. Yeah. You could also maybe bend the gender a bit, and that would be pretty, pretty swag. Uh, however, it does mean dirt, and that's really funny to me. It's really funny. Because he was made from, from dirt. I'm sh yeah. sure there's probably, like, some level of nuance to, like, the... Just because the languages are like that. Um... But it's funny. Uh, so many birds. We got a lot of birds, Riley. Just run, just run. This is Ganon's castle. You just gotta go. This is kind of Ganon's castle music. No, run, no, you gotta. Oh god. Oh, can't run now. Time to fight. He's fucking grooving! I don't wanna have to kill him! He's grooving! How can I bring myself to kill a fucking. a dude who's just chilling? He's chilling with style! Gotta get past him, Riley. No! It cannot be true. Say it ain't so! I'm sorry! I'm sorry! I'm sorry! <laughs> I'm so sad. <laughs> This was sadder than what you did to Rebecca. So. Yeah, my favorite friend, Groovin' Dude. Not more of him! <laughs> this is definitely a level designed to just make you run away. This game feels designed around not having all of your magic weapons that make ammo irrelevant. Yeah. Like, if you did have to conserve ammo, this would genuinely be like, oh fuck, I just gotta fucking spend it on these guys and not on all the birds. They can attack! Who knew? Do you think they're supposed to be like this? No idea. Couldn't tell you. Ooh, different birds. Weaker birds. These are their seagulls. He's kind of health kind of low. Hitting him with that sword kind of made him groove even more. So I have Who hey Echo, I have so that? many health potions. You still have the lasers from the staff that kills the final boss too, right? Mm-hmm. This game doesn't seem. I mean, like it seems hard to like control, but it doesn't seem hard to like play. It's not really, which is fine. Riley, maybe you, like having a lot of. Really? I didn't say. I walked off the edge and I didn't say. <laughs> I didn't say. This game doesn't seem that hard, I said. Of course I had to say that. Of course you did. Back on the straight button. The thing about strafing is that I have to move my hands that are like normally on the move keys. Yeah. Strafing But you only need not... strafing in this fight. You don't yeah. need to also move. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
It's so funny how simple it is. There's not even any like cool music. Like, it's like one of the primary antagonists. You, yeah, you like if you if you save Rebecca, you do you get a whole little cheeky little. If I die, I'm taking you with me. But he's nothing. He's nothing. This guy is this guy is as nothing as I thought he was. He's just kind of a henchman. He's supposed to be your rival or whatever, but. He's just some loser that the game keeps trying to make me think that, like, there's something, like, evil about his appearance. But I yeah. just look at him and I'm like, yeah. That's just yeah. a guy. It's this guy. It looks like he got burned or something. Or, like, maybe the circumstances of his birth made his face like that. But that's fine. That's okay. Seems like he's living his life. Yeah, I think I did that to him because I feel like he wasn't like that when I initially saw him. Hmm. Okay, well, then he's living his life in spite of the haters. Being me. Yeah. You're his number one hater in that you killed him. <laughs> That's true. I think if you kill somebody, you get to claim being their number one hater. I would say so also. I would probably agree with that. Unless, like, you you can choose not to claim that. You can be like, look, I didn't hate them. It was just a job, you know? But yeah. you, have you can right. also, you, yeah, you have the right to claim that. You can go into court and be like, look, I may have killed him. But I was his number one hater. And I'm going to be like, yeah, you know what? What do you want from me, Mabel says. Why do you why do you keep calling me to this place? Have you saved? I have not. Thank you for the reminder. I didn't. Call what are you saying, Mabel? Did you get summoned? Were you summoned, Mabel? So many fucking guys. Yeah, it, pretty confident it doesn't want you to kill him. But also, if I don't, they follow me into the cave. They don't de aggro ever. Yeah, it's a it's a challenge to like run and not fall off. A challenge you've already failed once. Yeah, so I'm making myself not have to do that challenge again. I have a shotgun ammo, so... I made a clip of your gameplay. I see. Thank you. Oscar, please stop kicking the wall the box. Og Champion. Call that a Pog moment. Oh my god, I shot it from all the way over here. That's so funny. Mm. Wow. Good job. Okay, now, after I kill these guys, I'm gonna stay. You can just hold control down. These men will not harm you. They they attack you when you close. It's so sad. We have to kill the Grooven dudes. I love those guys because they just dance. But no, the game wants me to kill them.
Oh my god. I think I might just want to use the shotgun here because there's so many of them. I don't... The thing is, I don't know if they followed you in here. I think there's just yeah, a there's, bunch more. Yeah, there's more here. of them. But the thing is, is that they spawn in front of me. Yeah. You can walk. A, it's a dodging, it's a dodger's trick. That was very scary. Yeah. This game is about asking yourself when you become a villain. That's true. That's true. If you save Rebecca or not. Chapter 6. Whether or not you save Rebecca, it makes little difference. We're in the mines now. We're really in the mines now. Okay, kind of swag glasses though. Kind of, kind of got, kind of got dressed up for this occasion. Dude, can you stop? I Hawk's just looking at him like, can you not do that with the cards? Can you like stop? Do it myself, you see. But with his bestowed immortality, the laws governing the sorcery wouldn't sanction it. But now he is gone. You, my dear boy, and I. Not for much longer. You know, I think he means to kill me. <laughs> that would be unwise, Adam. The sword without the shrive is useless against Florentine's flesh. For as long as he remains within the chamber, <laughs> the we gotta kill the hat man first. Once gone. And this chamber is the last place in creation where they can become one again. Only then, when the two are joined, can my flesh be destroyed. Take him off the edge then. You, uh, you got some choices here. Yeah. He's definitely hiding something. He's got the f f shitty little smirk. No. You're hiding something. I'm gonna go with my instincts on this. And achieve what? Your death? Know that I can crush you where you stand. Go on then. What are you waiting for? Does this make your task any easier? He just turns his back to you. He's like, go ahead. Stab me in the back with a sword. I want you to do it. This is a great idea. <laughs> I won't fight you. Okay, well, music's playing now, so... You will do as I command. Okay, man. Everyone's just like, oh, oh. <laughs> Fucking hangs his cane on his hand.
What the fuck can is you, he doing? Can you what stop that with the cards? Can you stop that with the freaking cards, dude? Are you fucking joke? It's the Joker. 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 It's the Joker. 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 Why are there so many Jokers in it's my deck? It's the oh, I got oh, the clown it's the deck. deck of Jokers. It's all Jokers. Oh, it's no. Jokers all the way down, it's... baby. <laughs> He's like a little frustrated. Nobody's enjoying his card bit. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, oh man, I thought it was really funny. That was just for spite, dude. I don't know, your flesh seems really destroyable. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Al. Hey, Al. Hey, man, you gotta, like, press your thumbs down if you wanna actually kill some. Alf, can you, uh... Thanks, Alf. Would you... Get owned. Get owned, old man. Do you think that can be made with modern technology? <laughs> I love that, of him falling into the pit. Like, appear a night guy and he hesitates and then throws his sword like a javelin? Like, in a movie or like, in real life? Why is he howling? The hat man howls! In real life and he's perfectly accurate? I think you could do it. Your time in this world has ended. A fool's hand is a dead man's hand. Prophecy will be fulfilled. Oh, I like how he's not on screen. <laughs> Yeah! Yeah! Just get his ass! Just one punch! He got him with the fool's hand! He fucking got him with the fool's hand! <laughs> the fool's hand! You would have smashed this. Seven seal. We never stood a chance. I might be stupid, but I'm not crazy. I'm not so sure about that, Alf. Alf. I hear a thread calling. A time here is almost. That's advanced. really funny, Maple. <laughs> Rebecca, you must also join the weave. Who the fuck do I fight? Join the weave. Who the fuck are we fighting? Abandon Who the fuck is the prophecy? Who's the Rebecca funniest? must take his place. You know the Dodger? I'm sorry, Adam. It, it is written happen. that only Rebecca That's can it. turn into ashes. Don't I'm sorry I lied to you. It's so green here. Sure you got this far. I know. Baby girl, you look like an alien. You're so green. I'll be there. <laughs> In the dreams. We can... What? Why are they the doing... Like... The being romantic tension between these two is so funny because it's like, I don't feel like, like, they just kind of ended up together. Hey Kelly, you're here for the final boss of Realms of the Haunting. <laughs> After the climax of the story has already happened. But, like, the it emotional climax has happened. Oh no, spoilers. I'm sure you were going to play this game so at some point, it. Kelly. Do I have to stab the dome?
the, the funny thing is, is that you joined right after all of the, like, narrative spoilers have already happened. And so it's like, ironically, despite it being the end of the game, I don't know if there's going to be that much, like, major that will be revealed. Well, hang on. Never mind. Am Wait, I talking to my dad? Is it God? 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 No, that's my dad. No, it's just my dad. Oh. I don't know. Hi, Dad. Dad, I know my boy. Does he have the pastor's collar? Yeah, he's a pastor. No. I don't think he was dressed like that, though, the rest of the time. Because he was just like, he was dis disheveled. Changing what Florentine and Belial have done here. Very soon, the house and the temple of the morning star will unravel to time. If you are caught within it, you will perish. A short escape sequence. Go. Take flight and flee this place. Yeah, Andrea, I wanted to beat the game today, and that means that this stream is uh, four hours and 45 minutes. And Florentine are dead. <laughs> Those puzzles took a lot longer yeah. than I expected. Remember that time we spent like 45 minutes on that one uh, puzzle in 7th Guess? So much I have to tell you. My boy. Yeah. Your heart has already spoken. Yeah. I didn't think there would be so many really long puzzles either. Um, surely this is the end, right? It's the last chapter. Yeah, and chapters aren't very long. You're just you're just getting out. Oh my god. Well, I should save. That's this is a very perilous place to save. I mean I gotta save somewhere, right? Yeah, maybe save again once you're out, but um All I can think is like, do you think this game like I've been thinking this today specifically because we're getting to the climactic parts right we kind of know what's going on yeah we got all this kind of pseudo christian shit going on um talking about the fate of the world and the nature of everything with the crystal and all that shit and all i can think is like you know what this feels like this feels like something that happens like in the world of like Fate Stay Night, and then <laughs> if you asked like a wizard that was like, "Hey, uh, what about this thing that happened in this house that was like the end of the world?" and they'd just be like, "Oh yeah, it just happens sometimes. It's not like a big deal." It doesn't. It's somehow like, despite them saying, it's the risk of. It's it's like, the the whole world will unravel and the evil will gain dominion or whatever. And explaining the nature of human will and its uh, power over the existence of demons. Uh, I I just can't feel like this is actually important. Oh my god. What the fuck is the... Where do I go? You gotta, you gotta look at your maps, Riley. You gotta get back through the house. Go leave. That is the final boss. What? That dog is the final boss. That dog is the final. That's the, the dog. That's the boss that you need the stop for. That fucking that's dog. A, that's not a boss. That's not a final boss. You've had bosses in boss arenas. Nope, that's the final boss. I mean, like... Cool, I guess. It's cool to put it in the house. It just... It's not presented that way. There should be a cutscene yeah. with the dog in it. Yeah, this is the final boss. It's the when the blue monster appears, and this is the only thing I can think would be that.
Oh my god. Good lord. Oh my god! Can you like stand outside the room that it's in? Does no, it, it can follow. Doorways? It can go through doorways, and also all the like proper doors like seal behind you as soon as you enter that room. Oh, I see. And you go down here. This is not the most efficient pathway. There's no enemies or anything though. Yeah. I would get your staff out, I guess. And also heal. How it's like just like a few hits, right? If you can land all of them. Yeah, it's three hits. This fucking music. It's so bad compared to a lot it's of the other videos. Fucking, it's fucking groovy. It just comes out of nowhere. Hey man, did that hit? No. I would. There we go. <laughs> I love the idea that this is the most nightmarish fight in the entire game. If you do what Riley did the first time, she got that staff and just go, oh, I can't figure out if it's recharging or not. Mm hmm. <laughs> Whoa! And yet. Jesus Christ, that's loud! It's so loud! What? So there it is. What the fuck? From beginning to end. The whole goddamn story. I know you think I'm crazy. Otherwise, I wouldn't be here. Why didn't he find it? Right. What? What do you mean? Now, if you don't mind, I'd rather you left me now. I'm very tired. I just want to go sleep. Why is he in here? You've been through a traumatic experience. Tell me about it. Why didn't they just put him in therapy? What happened? Oh my god. Time for your medication. This... Why is this sucker punch? Why is this Zack Snyder's sucker punch? What? Why is this Zack Snyder's sucker punch for boys? Okay, Zack Snyder's sucker punch is for boys. Um, in spite of its desire to not be for boys, but why? Why did they do that? Why did they do that right at the very end? I have no idea. What could you possibly? That's like the worst ending. It's just like an attempt to undercut the entire fucking story. Like I was saying it was unimportant. I wasn't saying it was fucking fake. Why did they do- did they think that made it cooler? Did they think that was like a good thing that you do to a story to make it better? Yeah. I really just don't. This is like a team of people, like, very yeah. talented artists and game designers and, like, developers, like, programmers and, like, musicians. And all these people came together and worked really hard. The fucking actors honestly did fucking fine. The, the like, moment to moment writing was a little silly, but it's just like, it feels like they didn't understand how to make a compelling story. Like they were doing stuff they thought was cool, but. Yeah, there's a bunch of narrative analysis and saying like, it all didn't happen. It all was... It was all fake. Or 
it and those characters are just the people from the mental institution or it did happen and then Belial never actually died and he's actually just like he got you again with his tricks but uh i think it's bad i think either way that's a bad ending <laughs> Like, you get all the closure. You talk to your fucking dad. The story's over. And then it's like, damn, but it was fake. Maybe? And it's like, hey, um, I'm, I'm like, grabbing the writers. I'm grabbing the writers by the fucking neck like I'm Belial, and I'm going, hey. You know people have to, like... People get put in... Even, like, shitty 90s mental mental institutions, people still have to get put in them for a reason. Like, yeah. what did he do? Because he was so crazy talking about all those demons and stuff. That's crazy. Why was he doing that? Why but also, he maybe that? he was there the whole time. Then, then what was the point of the story? Why did we just do this? This is not just like Centennial Case of Shijima Sori. Because this one was bad the whole time. It's just like <laughs> illuminating at the very end. Um, because yeah, it's just like that, that like final moment isn't to me like, oh, it ruins the entire story, but they used to be good. It's like, oh, now I'm thinking about how the story didn't understand what's good about any story that it's inspired by. It's yeah, it's like shit. inspired by like Silent Hill and stuff, but it's also like, wait, is Silent Hill even out at this point? I don't know. But it's like, it really does feel like it's like... Like, it's, like, kind of doing, like, an Eldritch Horror thing, but it's, like, th there's just, like, people. Like... What? And people are saying that because Adam is the narrator, it's, like, unreliable narrator is the whole point, but it's, like... It just comes out of nowhere. Like... He's just not the narrator. He's not even... He's, like, commenting on shit. He's not fucking narrating the story. Yeah. I got no clue. But thank you all for watching another episode of yeah. the Forbidden Mystery Vault. This goes to show everybody, this proves that the message of this game all along was if you like Fate Stay Night, you should go to therapy. <laughs> True. If you don't like Fade Stay Night, you should probably also go to therapy. It's pretty good for you. <laughs> but it's you true. might need medicine if you like Fade Stay Night. <laughs> you should be medicated if you like Fade Stay Night. <laughs> okay. I used to like Fade. I didn't realize this was related. Okay, I'm just, I can't be bothered during a raid, because I'm tired. Good, goodbye, everyone. Yeah. Thank you for watching. Hey. Happy December. We'll see you all next week. Uh, different time, though. It'll be Sunday CST, 8 p.m. On, uh, Damn. Yeah. Because, uh... F... FMV night. FM... F... FM Monday. F Monday V. Sky went to reverse therapy. Yeah. If you have a family member or a loved one who's like against going to therapy and, and it thinks still still feels like it's it's not something that they should need to do or that it, it's a sign of weakness, sit them down and make them watch Fate Stay Night. <laughs> and that's the note that we'll end on. Thank you all for watching. <laughs>